seem to get like a solid finish to it too. Uh, welcome to the stream this evening. I'm uh, going to be hitting up uh, some more Red Dead and uh, continuing on with HC Dime Novel issue 004 at this point. Uh, it is uh, uh, subtitled The Times. Uh, big Howdy going on out to uh, GG Hick and uh, Alteran. Good to see both of you tonight, and I'm uh, glad you could make it for the show. Um, tonight's uh, episode, I'm going to be starting off um, working with a, a little different something here. And uh, we're going to try to, uh, we're, well, we're going to do another uh, another one of the uh, letters to, uh, to the home office. Um, and uh, we'll see how that goes. I think I got it. I think I think I got it this time um and uh, a couple of other things I, I do apologize that uh, that it it, uh, it took a little bit longer than I had hoped to uh, get things underway but I wanted to double check and make sure because I did a little experiment and for those of you again I also wanted to say uh, sorry to those of you uh, on Twitch uh, they got the notification that I was uh, on I, it, I don't know it was an experiment it, uh, it, it did okay. It gave me the answers I was looking for. How's that? And uh, that's all you can ask for. Um, tonight's episode, I, I, I have a couple of things in mind. Uh, some things that we can uh, uh, kind of uh, take a look at. And uh, not only that, but uh, I also have uh, a feeling that there's, there's definitely potential out there. Um, I, uh, got a little chance to, uh, mess around with some things, and, uh, I think, I think we're in good shape. And, uh, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, I'm really looking forward to it. And, uh, we'll see where it goes. But, uh, again, thanks everybody for, uh, uh, joining me here for the live streams. Uh, do appreciate you coming and hanging out with me. And also, a big thanks to all of you watching in, uh, the future. Uh, checking these out on the VODs. Um, I I really do appreciate you guys coming by and watching. Because uh, I, I never know how it how it goes. I, I don't really... I'm aware of the situation that I'm in. But, you know... I, I, I'm trying to uh, focus on uh, where Robert is. And uh, I know in the last stream... I, I kind of, yeah, I, I, there was a couple of moments where I was like, hmm, you know, the, these, this is not, not exactly a wise decision. And, uh, and then realized, you know what, it, that's, he's a journalist, and that's what he does. He, he makes a lot of unwise decisions, and uh, hopefully they lead to a story, which uh, I think is kind of my ultimate goal in this thing is uh, to put these dime novels in uh, the form of uh, the stories that they are. Uh, to kind of show some of the other people's stories as they're happening. And uh, to be an observer, like uh, the name of the last stream. And uh, I think I think this is going to be fun. <laughs> this particular, yes, I agree. This particular journalist should be making very questionable decisions. And, uh, that's, believe me, there was, there was definitely moments in that stream where I was like, oh, no, nope, 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 okay, let's do that. And, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was kind of cool. Um, and then also the same in the previous stream. So I'm starting to get a little bit more comfortable with, uh, with that. Uh, the being in a very different, uh, frame of logic. And, uh, also I think it's, uh, it's also becoming a little bit more um, second nature, uh, which is going to help out a whole lot uh, for what I've got uh, coming, or at least uh, what I'd like to see uh, in uh, in the future, uh, as far as the uh, story elements that I I am going to check off the list of things that need to be done. But alas. I can't ever guarantee that that's going to happen. And that's the best part about this. Is uh, I'm not really sure where we're going. I have an idea. But uh, it works so well with this character. 
um, that uh, I think it's going to be a lot of fun uh, to uh, to really get him off the ground. And like I said, this is only the fourth one, um, and uh, for the most part, uh, pretty pretty much what I'm trying to do is get him out there. Uh, you know, throw the name around, um, see what uh, what comes up in uh, the form of different things, and uh, just go with it. Uh, which is uh, basically the form of journalism that I'm, I'm sort of uh, taking on is uh, to be an active participant in uh, whatever it is, and uh, I think I think this will work. So, uh, with that, and uh, without further ado, let's uh, let's take a look at uh, H.C. Dime Novel number zero zero four. The Times. Thanks again for joining me. Enjoy the show, everybody. How about now? Can you hear it now? What's going on?
Okay. Anything? Oh. Okay, good. Now you can hear me? You can hear me and the music. All right. There we go. I knew it. I knew we had to have some kind of catastrophe in order to get this started, which is okay because the the letter, the letter was okay, but it, it wasn't my best uh, my best version of it. So I got a good practice run in. Once again, thanks for letting me know. I, I don't think I would have caught it because I was uh, definitely in there. Um, yeah, apparently it's this screen. I don't understand why, but uh, okay, we'll work around it. Uh, let's do. Let me do this. Okay, so, uh, can, can you now see the picture and hear me? Yes and yes. Okay, good, good. That's, that's all we can ask for at this point. <laughs> Thanks again. I, I, I'm not really sure. Apparently there's, there's some issues. I did, I did some weird modifications, and apparently that has paid off uh, in a bad way. Uh, which is okay, because I, I actually, looking looking at what the world looks like, need to kind of stall for a second here anyways. Um, okay, so basically what you missed is uh, this opening uh, that I wanted to put in here for this. And uh, it's in the form of a letter. It goes as such. HC Sports Desk to Edward Gordon from Robert Stockton regarding total coverage. Eddie, I hope this letter finds you stuck in some foreign place with no way of returning in the near future. Seems like a harsh greeting. But it's my basic takeaway from your reply to the current dilemma that you've placed me in. There's no joy in Mudville, and I'll tell you what, there's no goddamn baseball team in San Denis either, old sport. In fact, many of the folks that I've spoke with don't even know what the sport of baseball is. Odd? Maybe. But when you get out in the real world, you'll find out that folks don't have time for such nonsense as leisure. They work hard to get by. A concept I suspect may be strange to you in your sort, Mr. Gordon. It's high time you put some thought into that idea, mull it around a bit. Roll up your sleeves and get some real stories into that rotten publication your grandfather started, or you'll be standing at home plate without even swinging once. Old Ernest Thyler was talking directly to you, coach, and the next time you two chew the rag while boozing it up over the cocktails, I'm guessing that you can ask him if Casey still resides in Mudville. I think we both know the grim answer to that, don't we, Eddie? The way I see it, you have to abandon all hope of ever getting your name into the social elite magazines unless you steer this publication into deeper waters, and soon. Oddly enough, I think we may have a solution that we've been looking for. It could only cost you a small amount of money and you can give that to me up front. There's things going on here, Gordo. It's no Calaveras County, but lying about frogs is one of your great talents. I'll send you what I find and see if you can spin that yarn into gold. Time to make Mr. Clemens proud, Edward. Sincerely, Robert. P.S. 
attaches this week's expenses for immediate compensation.
Blue. Hello? Let me know, dude. Me. Yeah, the audio is up on that. There we go. Okay. Sorry about that. Okay. Sorry about that. Oh, I guess it is still doing that. Weird. Okay. That should do it. Um, no. In fact, it's probably... This is another one of those moments where my brain goes, This is a trap. And that's not supposed to be doing that. Uh, okay. There are challenges. The struggle buggy is real. Come on. There you go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, dude, that was, that was the first thing that I thought was like, okay, this is an RDR thing right here. This is, this is like so... The, what were those called? The little side mission thingies that... The random side missions that were kind of like eventually you just got to the point where you were like, Look, I'm not helping you people. How long do I have to keep passing by until you find this out? So, uh... Riding around, um, I got a little bit of uh, time to play around with the buggy some more, and uh, I'm I'm really in, enjoying uh, using this. It's a it's a nice little form of travel for him because um, I'm trying to get him into the moving from place to place quite a bit, uh, so that I can uh, speak with people. I uh, get a couple of good uh, good runs in, and uh, I'm feeling, like I said, a little bit better about uh, uh, rolling the character uh, backstory and conversation. But uh, still working on it, so we got that. Yeah, encounters sounds right. It was some it was some weird thing that they called them that you were kind of like, yeah, okay, this is. This is right next to the auto fire bit. Which I seem to, uh, I think I curbed it. But, of course, the combination of the everybody updating all of their stuff all at once has uh, brought up new things. Although it doesn't seem to be doing it now as much. But it used to be that, like, if I just even ha touched the uh, the mouse wheel, it would immediately bring this up and immediately grab whatever weapon I had and pull it out. So I had to completely change that so that the uh, mouse wheel is basically dead uh, in main mode. And I don't know why... It's just some thing about how it works. And, and it when the scroll wheel is set up, if I move my mouse itself without even touching the scroll wheel to the left or right too fast, it suddenly does the same action. Which that action is, you know, just uh, in the normal thing, is scrolling brings up this menu and allows you to kind of move around in it. But, uh, yeah, I don't know what that is. Or why that happened. It was just kind of uh, very irritating and uh, obnoxiously. Uh, <laughs> it would happen at uh, just the wrong time, you know. Uh, much like the auto fire. 
I am a witness. You shot that person. But uh, yeah, I get a chance to cart this little this location that we're we're headed through right here. It's part of the reason I had to kind of keep jostling the auto uh, run was so that it got this area. I found this uh this is a great little spot for when the weather's just like this, especially for the uh, the fall. This has that uh, like I said. I don't know, again, they, I think they've psychologically done it to me with uh, having a couple of days of, uh, of that. But uh, is, uh, this is just, it, it's a, the location feels like there's a cold mist. Uh, even though it, it's like clearly the middle of the afternoon right now. So I love it. It definitely uh, adds to the feel. Yeah, I'm loving the uh, the cart um, because, like I said, mainly the big thing about this is is that uh, he needs to get from place to place, and sometimes this is going to be like real long distance runs uh, from one side of the map to the other, and uh, the horses are okay for that, but uh, with the uh, the stamina system and the horse that I currently have, it basically will get me out there. And then I'll have to, uh, like, uh, have another horse uh, to get back. And uh, the nice thing about this is, is that uh, you can run it, uh, and there, there, right now there isn't any stamina. Now, they're going to change that, obviously, but for now, it'll, uh, it'll assist me in uh, getting, uh, getting around, which is uh, my first objective. Getting around means that I get a, a wider range of people that I run into. Not only that, but uh, these carts are cool enough to, that uh, when you're when you're when you're hand roll on them, uh, and uh, that little thing that we had that uh, we met the uh, Ranger Abraham on uh, the last stream. And uh, he showed us that uh, that location. Now that's way, way out west, and it is an amazing location. But uh, I also have a feeling there's many, many other places like that. And uh, doing the cart thing uh, is a lot of fun. And like I said, really, the one thing that I was thinking originally that is uh, like this character in very specifically needs is uh, something along the lines of the Mint 500, uh, where it's a, just a giant endurance race. And uh, these two-person carts would be great for uh, a driver and uh, a navigator. Uh, and, you know, I mean, it'll obviously, if you do that kind of thing, it's on the honor system, but, man, that's the cool thing about being on an RP server, is, is that you can, you know, you can kind of kind of tell if uh, people are doing what I'm doing right here. Because I can, um, riding along now, I, it, it's not hard to tell because there's just certain mechanics about the way this, this moves uh, and the way it moves when somebody's piloting it. And I think it would be kind of cool to do that. Uh, I have a bunch of other ideas for that kind of thing. But, uh, you know, it, it's, it's, all, it's all ideas until uh, we start to kind of set it in motion. And I know that uh, he was talking about uh, assisting as well, but uh, I, I kind of want to get to get some other, uh, I want to uh, get some other things in as, uh, as, as, uh, as much as possible, obviously. But uh, yeah, this is a great little thing on the way.
great. It is so fun. I love it. It's a... Uh, the game really... It, it does such a good job with things like that. Uh, the ability to uh, kind of uh, run that. Uh, let's see here. Um, before we get into town. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Christmassy there. There we go. Okay, so heading on into Blackwater. Um, probably swing. I'm gonna definitely swing by because I could probably use something to eat and uh, uh, whatnot. Um, 
Let's see if the store has any of the, uh... Other supplies. Dogs are back. Hello. Think somebody lost a horse. If I can get this in. Otherwise, I might have to go around the barn. <laughs> Looks like a... Oh, looks like they're out of everything. Oh, that's okay. Get that covered. And we're at a general store. kind of what I was gonna see if I could get more of that because I got a bottle of it uh, earlier today and um, we'll see how it goes but uh, yeah it's this uh, this right here that's it dirty sparkling botanical water it's uh, actually a uh, recipe uh, that you can make with the right equipment and uh, supposedly it uh, covers the degrade on being thirsty. We'll see. Uh, I needed to, while I'm in town, uh, let's see, I got I'm good on everything. Yeah, I'm good on everything. Why is that unequipped? Oh no, it is. Okay, never mind. Hmm. What that was. Yeah. What I'm gonna do. We got that y'all inside of here. Uh, I'll stay outside and have a look out. Alright. Excuse me. Uh, <laughs> it uh, definitely feels like depositing money right now is a good idea. Mm. Yes, yes, I know.
Honey. Uh, excuse me. Yes. What's up? Uh, what? What's your name? Uh, Robert. Robert, have you uh, seen Draven around? No, I just got into town, so I haven't had a chance to see anybody. Actually, uh, it's uh, surprisingly quiet. All right. Uh, well, there's some fellas there in the bar. I gotta go, but uh, thank you. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, good luck. That seemed ominous. <laughs> there are some fellers in the bar. Well. Well then. That's what they're saying. Yep. Oh, no. If you're trying to stand out, well, good job. Oh. Uh, I Howdy. See, but, but I understand what you mean. Howdy there. Hello. How are you fellas doing? Good, good. I'm doing oh, pretty well, good. How about you, sir? Good, good. Just getting into town. Oh, I just got here? Yeah, yeah. Grab something to eat real quick. You been here for a long? Oh, uh, just got in. Yeah, I've been here a while, but, uh, you know, I come in and out of town. I'm kind of all over the map. I see, I see. Mm hmm, mm hmm. What towns you been? All of them. I've uh, been bouncing around in between all of the towns, uh, speaking with folks about uh, uh, sports teams. Oh, okay, sports teams. Yes, sir. What, what kind of sport? Well, okay. So, originally, I was uh, sent down here to uh, look into a, a National League team that uh, was supposed to start up over in, uh, over, over in San Denis, and uh, sure enough, uh, nobody even knows what they're talking about. Hey. Nah, I, I, there's no sports around here. I, I mean, I've never seen a team around here in these parts. Yeah. Out of the news and know nothing. I don't know why. Yeah, that's exactly it. And, uh, you know, I, I, I'm guessing my editor, uh, you know, the uh, obviously drunkard that he is, I uh, got some kind of word about this from, uh, some guys in the bar, which is usually how it goes. And, uh, sure enough, you know, he sends me out here, and, uh, oh, 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 oh. But, uh, okay. yo. I have no clue what this guy's talking about. What? You don't, you don't know what baseball is? I never baseball. heard from, never heard about it a day in my life. Really? Look, Casey at the bat. Oh. You said baseball. Yes, that's it. What's that? Well, it's a it's, it's a game with a you know, basically a you know guy hurls a ball and uh, another guy hits it with a stick. You know. Okay. Interesting. Oh you know, yeah, it's real oh, big yeah. back I, east. I've heard about it, but I've never done it. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's real big back east, and uh, you know they've got uh, there's actually now two leagues, uh, oh, like really? uh, teams in all different cities, and uh, yeah, the big corporate thing. Uh, they all seem real big on it. But right. it's the kind of thing the rich people out east do. Yeah, I like I, to I hit I like to that. hit people with things, especially sticks, but I never hit the uh, stick with bull. Oh the yeah, you'd be great. Out east, you're talking about? Well, I never the heard about from it I'm oh, sorry, what was it? Talking about rich people in Saint Denis? No, 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 I'm talking about out east, you know. They got so much time in their hands now that without working that uh, they they go and watch uh, other people play games. Oh, I know. It's, oh, I, okay. I think I know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people over there kind of lazy. Not gonna lie. Well, uh, I don't know. It's, it's 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 just a different different way of living, I guess. But you know so much about it. You you come from over there. Well, yeah. I I originally uh, grew up in the Midwest. And uh, I went out east uh, to uh, to study uh, uh, at uh, college, and uh, have been a journalist for uh, the last ten years. Fine tobacco. I know, man. I just got it from that saloon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The uh, tobacco around here is uh, amazing. Where, where, where other places you've tried the tobacco? Uh, well. Over on the other side of roads, uh, there's a oh, okay. yeah, there's a place yeah, where uh, I you... uh -huh. 
Yeah, uh, the, the, over there. They didn't know. Yeah, um, uh, like, uh, I thought we were talking different regions or something like that. Sorry. Oh. Well. You ever tried Cuban tobacco? Hell yeah. Yeah, Cuban tobacco is the best. Uh, my opinion. Other than mm -hmm. other than going around talking with people about balls, what uh, what do you do for a living? Is you're gonna be? Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm a I'm a journalist. A uh, sports writer. I, I write about things. Uh, well, I was writing about sports, and uh, and uh, well, uh, since there really isn't any, I, I don't do much of that here. But uh, you know, I, I, I'm uh, helping a friend out, who's uh, got a uh, a publication that he uh, inherited. Uh, hi they're, there, hi there. They're called Dime Novels. Hello. Howdy, Mr. Green. Would you be willing to do the bar while I go see about Mr. Draven? Yep. I'm. Uh, let me go change my clothes, but I will Hello. be back. All right. All right. You know, I'm from, I'm, I've seen baseball before. I'm from New York, but uh, not not really my thing. You know, I never I never played or anything myself. Oh yeah, the uh, Brooklyn team's monster this year. Good bunch of good hitters. That's where I'm from, Brooklyn. Right on, right on. Yeah, enough about sticks and balls for me. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. But anyways, uh, yeah, we were, uh, I, I'm out here to, to kind of, uh, uh, you know, uh, well, at this point, since there is no story, uh, I'm just uh, kind of uh, going Where's around meeting folk. Okay, okay. Well, sir, it's been a pleasure to meet you. I didn't catch your name. Yo, it's Robert. Robert Stockton. And Robert, uh, Robert I didn't Stockton. catch your name. My name's Chucho. Chucho Carranza. All right. Nice to meet you. Yeah, very nice I'll to meet you. see you around. Since yeah, for sure. Around towns, well, I'd stick around Valentine most of the time. But okay, yeah. I'll see you around, I guess. Yeah, yeah. I'll be uh, bouncing care, in between Mr. all the towns, so yeah, you'll probably see me. All right, sir. Take care you of have yourself. Have a good day. Good evening. Where are we heading to next? Well, we just got here, I'm trying to enjoy me a cigar. Get, get no, I mean like. Get... Oh, uh, I'm, yeah. Get yourself a whiskey over there. They got good whiskey here. No, I just meant like in town. Give me a good old beer. No, I might get another one. <clears throat> How many uh, beers? Hey, this beer, root beer. So I used to be a, to be a coal beer. miner myself, oh, wow. but... Um, Looking, already, for a new, looking for a new line of work. You know, already retired from that? I'd like to. But it's a Maybe. fallback plan. If all else, you know, fails, I can go back to coal mining. We're kind of looking at, we're kind of looking for people who can, like, make uh, ingots, uh, blacksmith, basically. i seen a blacksmith in, uh, in Valentine. He had his, um, his um, prices posted just outside the stable there. Uh, yeah, if you fellas just... don't mind, I gotta write down some prices. I'm a little newer here, so uh, sorry about the wait. Well, you're no don't even worry about it. Yeah, it takes you down. You're fine, sir. Don't worry. But yeah, I saw I saw I saw the blacksmith. You mean? But I didn't see him there. He was he had closed a store for the day, I think. Yeah, no, I haven't seen him either. I just seen the signs. That's all. You're talking about uh, the guy in Valentine? Yeah. Yeah. The blacksmith. Yeah, yeah, he's, uh, he's on, uh, well, later. I understand. Mm-hmm. Yeah, real nice guy. Mm -hmm. Some good bar. Do, do you know if he'll smell, if he'll smell things for you for a price? Um, you know what, I really don't know. Um, I know he was, he's been looking for, uh, uh folks to, uh, help him work. From what I've seen, he just buys the gold off of you at a at a fair price. Yeah, a slightly better price. Yeah. Might be worth it to go check him out, but we just we just left Valentine, so it's not. No point coming back, going back there. How much gold you got? That's a secret question, but actually, right now I don't have any. I'm just asking, just, you know. So I bought this Schofield revolver and I'm 
kind of disappointed in it. Well, yeah. Why would you say that? Yeah, me too. Yeah, just not as uh, powerful as I thought it'd be. I heard it depends on the person behind the trigger. Yeah, you got well, a good point. I don't know how that's going to make a gun more powerful, but that's why depends I got this shotgun here. I mean, it's a gun, right? Yeah, a gun will shoot. Yeah, it's not. Uh -oh. uh, not yeah. yeah, not the same. It's not the same for definitely. Yeah, that's a piece of shit. Get the fuck out of my face, Abraham. I uh, see so you got some long arms on your back. What you got there? Me right here? I got the... I just got the carbine repeater and the... But I did get the semi-auto shotgun. That that thing, that thing is cool. Yeah, I was looking at that. I ended up getting the pump. It was a little more affordable. Yeah, it'll still shoot buckshot, so win-win. Right, right. I got it, I got it. How's, the, how's that semi-auto though? What's what's that like? What's that uh rapid fire? Yes yeah, sir, yes yeah, sir, it's good. I, I got it I got it for protection because you know uh, getting the gold, chances of getting mugged are high, so with a shotgun on my side, anybody that got close getting you getting blown away, you know? Yeah, I'll be just taking a, a minute in my head. <sighs> but I'm good. Shooting in with a Schofield, not so much, but with a shotgun that leaves a mark. Indeed. And I see, um... Man, I forgot. I just forgot what I was gonna say. I'm sorry, guys. Things are right. finally getting better. You deserve it. Where you fuck from? I understand uh, you were from New York, right? Uh, Freddy. Excuse me. Pardon me. I really hope it's our business holders usually and stuff like that. Really hope no matter how wealthy we get we never turn out like them. Thank you. Steak over there. He's got, see, they got real good stew here. You want to try that out? I don't know if you like that, but my stew always comes good from the saloons. To be honest, hey, where I'm from? I'm from Valentine. Oh, local from Valentine. Yeah, I'm you. I'm usually uh from the mountains, but you know, as I grew up, I came to Valentine. Not really a tribe, but you know, I'm half Indian, so. I heard some talk.
that there was a bad shooting over in Valentine a couple days ago. Almost, uh, almost every day. Almost every day over there. I wasn't around that much, but I haven't heard anything about that. That's strange. But there was problems with the gangs, and they've been talking about them too a lot. And and the folk with that got the axe to the head too, John Fisher. Oh yeah, John Fisher, the axe man. Yeah, yeah. Howdy, fella. Can I get you anything? Wasn't hey, was like how you doing? Um, doing alright. What the? Uh... What do you got as far as uh, something to eat? Uh, on me, I got some stew and oranges. Okay. Uh, what uh, what you charge on the stew? <laughs> What's kind of uh, three dollars for black, a stew, huh? bud. Okay. Kind of obvious question. Uh, yeah, I'll take a take a stew and uh, uh, what, uh gonna no, whiskey. Just... No, man. You know, a whiskey. Just had somebody yeah. Earlier yeah, that sounds good. What, what was I? After it's, I told him uh, my name, he was like. Okay. Okay. Name. Yeah. Well, what's your name, though? I don't think I caught. I don't think I caught it. I can't remember. One second. I'm sorry. My name's Caligro. Yeah, Caligro. Yeah, Caligro Gumby. Oh, night. I was calling KG. KG. Yeah, KG is what you can call me. KG sounds right. sound dope. That'd be eight dollars. Sounds pretty good. Yeah. There you go. KG. Oh, thank you. My, my yeah, brain, no problem. My brain's not too smart, so uh, KG oh, is nah. much better. <laughs> I forgot y'all name already, so I understand. My name's Ruben. And <laughs> yeah, there you go, Ruben. sir. Okay, let me, Thank you. let me write that. Well, down. it looks great. Well, what's the other one's name? Tucho. My name's Freddy. Freddy, okay. Excellent, excellent. Mm. Me I and just, uh, I just met all y'all. A little bit better now, but. Other than that, they don't really know the other people that well. So you all, you all know each other? Well, that's the beauty of new introductions. Of course. Now we know each other forever, so... Yes, yes. Might as well make the best Howdy, of it. Da. Howdy. Howdy. Hey, I get you anything, miss? Yeah, what do you got? Uh, Russian? Well, any, uh, Mother Russia. Wait, wait. Wait, I've heard Chucho call you. The very last. I've heard Chucho call you Marina. What? What's Marina. her name? Marina. Come over here. Hey, there excuse me, sirs. Uh, oh, could you, you kind of keep your voice down a little sorry, bit? Sorry. sorry. No, you're all right. Yes, Boy, Marina. Mm -hmm. been whispered. Anyways, sorry about okay. that. Uh, Can I get from you? Why, why come over here to the west? Over on the other side of the well, road, right? Well, let's just say, you know, uh, I had a cut deal. Still was, they told me uh, to get out of Russia, because if I stay, I will have a hit on my head. So I chose countryside, now I'm here. I heard in Russia they eat polar bears. Pull polar bears, Russell polar bears, any kinds of bears. Barehanded? With your fist, yeah. Ah. You ever wrestle bear? With my gun. Probably a shotgun too. I still enough. got a nasty scar on my face. I see, I see. Why did you ask me? Well, you just said you got a scar from my family. I'm thinking you don't remember all your killings. No, no, no. I said that I fired it with, uh, with a shotgun or something. Still got a scar on my face. And I don't even know how they can fight with their fists. You know, that's. Take some balls, take some bones, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's all right. It's just, I, I didn't understand. What does that mean? No, no, I think there's some more folks. I think this bartender's annoyed that we're talking. No, I didn't think we were just talking too loud because there's other conversations What's going on on the board and everybody that wants to hear a conversation. Yeah, we have to we have to whisper inside bars usually. Yeah, when it gets crowded, um, you can't hear when you're asking for an order and stuff like that. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, I'm, I'm talking as low as I can. Oh, oh it's wrong. Go ahead. I, don't think, I, I think he was just talking to people that were talking too low, not, not the ones that are already... Uh, so, uh, how your travels been, sir? 
I'm doing good. Doing good. Thank you. You guys been busy? Of course. Uh, I just showed back up here <clears> earlier. I don't, if you remember me riding up to you, asking you a question real quick. Sorry about that. Oh, yeah. No, no. Uh, I thought that was you. But, uh, you know, okay. it's hard to tell sometimes. Right, right. We were just uh, looking for a fella that got snatched up. Because uh, I was riding with some law. Damn. Well, uh, hopefully you, uh, you get some leads or something. Yeah, well, the, you know them bollards move fast. Oh, damn. Uh, that's who it is, huh? Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, I let them know uh, uh, back at the home office that, uh, you know, these guys were uh, were out here. Are you, like, looking for Oh, yeah, they've been very active today. I actually had a run-in earlier with them, and I... I took a shot to the I'm shoulder, actually. Damn. Out, wow. You test, and, uh, and, you're, and here you are. That's a... Uh, damn. Yeah, it was a lot earlier in the day. I do feel a little better, though. Trying well, that's good. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah. Well, kudos to you for uh, coming into work. Because... Well, of course. Yeah, I, uh, I came back and I seen... Uh, no one was in here, so I stepped in. And then someone asked me to tend. So here I am. Excellent, excellent. Yeah. It's actually, uh, it is my first day on the job, though. Well, you're doing great. You're doing great. Uh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Look, Hello, sir, there. what can I get for you? Can I just get one glass of whiskey? Well, of course. Uh, that'll be five dollars. Five dollars, absolutely. What's your name, friend? My name is Henry Green. Henry Green, good to meet you. Liam McCarthy. Oh, uh, Liam, I think I, uh, seen you over there in, uh, Valentine? I said I used to be a coal earlier. miner. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure you've seen me a lot of places. Line of work. I came down here to prosper. It's supposed to be the land of prosperity. That's it. I need anything else. You don't happen to have the glass. We're going barfly, at least uh, for now. I don't believe so yet. No. Getting a couple of good things here. So you're saying uh, you're riding with the law, huh? They deputize you? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, well, I'm looking to become a deputy. Oh, okay, okay. No. Uh, as of right now, you know, I'm just trying to get my name hat. out there a little bit. Trying sure. to get to know people. Bad, yeah. Trying to help it's people out and stuff. Yep, yeah, I completely understand. You know, uh, you that's kind of... They left, uh, the home office basically left me out here. So, you know, I gotta, I gotta fend for myself. And, uh, the best thing is, uh, meet the folk. Right, right. Plus, you know, uh, the stories write themselves. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's good fodder to, to get them to keep sending me money out here. Yeah, always. The, uh, actually only my second day in the state, really. Yep, yep. Uh, well, first day I was here, you know, I didn't have a job, but I did write out with some law. I guess two people got, uh kidnapped we were looking for him well actually no they got robbed but we couldn't find Jeez. anybody sounds like there's plenty of work for you oh yeah there's been a lot of trouble around hmm <clears throat> well that's good because uh i i hear there's a couple of sheriff's elections going on so uh good to see some right. change yeah see i'm looking at uh, i was looking at you know, just start out as a deputy. I don't really want to be a ranger or marshal. At least not anytime soon. Exactly. Well, you got to learn the ropes, you know? Right, exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, I am liking it here in Blackwater, though. Some good, some good yeah, music. seems like a great little town. The, uh, yeah, seems... the folks out here have been uh, nothing but accommodating uh, every time I uh, ride through. Right, right. Well, uh... I'm gonna have to go in my head for a bit, but I'll uh, yep. try to find the other bartender. No, yeah, no, that's fine. Take your time. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm just kind of resting up before I gotta run someplace else. I know. Well, if I'm not back by then, uh, you ride safe. Yeah, you as well. Thank you. Hey, fellas, uh, I'm gonna go in my head for a bit. I'm gonna go try to find the other bartender if y'all need anything. See you soon.
Yeah, I'm pretty good with my, with my uh, firearms, yes sir. There we go again. More time, time, time. more time for the ballers. Hey man, if it's some of that experimental tobacco, I don't want it. I think they, uh, they seem to be the, uh, the big ones in town. Howdy there, sir. Howdy. Hey, hey Liam, you in the here? Uh, I think he uh, went down the street, headed towards the bank. Okay, thanks. Yep. I think that was him. <laughs> you know, you don't verify your news. You just give them news, right? Welcome to everybody joining us uh, for the uh, uh, HC Dime Novel number four. The Times was uh, the title I went with this. And uh, I don't know if you guys have caught it yet, but, you know, there's there's a theme somewhere in there. Um, basically we're, we're headed over, uh, we're here in, uh, Blackwater, which is, uh, putting us at, uh, about the halfway point on the map, uh, for those of you that, uh, aren't familiar with the map of the state, uh, this is basically where we, uh, uh, we came in and, uh, we're hanging out. Two parts facts, one part assumptions, you got it. That is 100% good journalism right there. That's actually, hmm, I don't know. It's, it's a little, it's a little facty. Going for a buy. Um, but yeah, we actually started off, uh, we were uh, somewhere over in this area right here. And, uh, we rode over to Blackwater. And then, uh, my, uh, my plan was to, uh, barrel on out to Tumbleweed. And, uh, uh get out into, uh, the western area again. Uh, this time hopefully without, uh, it completely covered in snow. Because I wanted to show you guys that area. And, uh, go maybe take a look at that racetrack area too. Again. Um, and then, uh, my other plan was, uh, we gotta head over to this area right here. Because I'm gonna head to hit this bait shop. And we're gonna hit this bait shop, actually. That's where we're headed next. None of that. wrong with that. Back to the bar. Maybe Chucho is. I'm just trying to make some money, so get some folk to get some folk that have my back and I have theirs kind of thing. How did you how did you meet the other guys? Freddy? I just met all y'all in Valentine. Oh, so we are okay. So you met them in Valentine. Mm -hmm. Was Marina with the uh, with KG? That's right. And so they knew before they knew each other from before. Yeah, they said they know each other a while. I wonder. Now I wonder how they met. What? I know we all just met up. KG, Caligro. Yeah, they knew each other from before, that's what I'm saying. I just wanted to make sure. I and and, and Freddy here was was with them be from before, so I thought he, he knew a little more. Uh just rolling down. Yeah, I see. Let's take this conversation outside, will we? Yes. Better suited for the house. 
No more eavesdropping. Well, looks like you came in and the police cleared out. Yeah, it's... It's whatever. Yeah, yeah exactly. Run the bar. Name's Robert, by the way. Mike. 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 There's an A and an H on me. Oh, I gotcha. Micah. Very good. business or you live here or I haven't seen you around friend yeah yeah well I uh I'm uh kind of uh always on the move so you know I, I don't uh I'm a, I'm a all kinds of weird hours and stuff so I don't usually get a chance to meet everybody and uh mm -hmm. I'm kind of running from town to town so you know it, it's it's real random as to uh whether I uh meet up with people hmm. interesting yep yep well it's the life of a journalist. Hmm. You gotta go where the story is, if even if there isn't one, you know? Fair enough, I suppose. No, no, well, a lot of the time it's just chasing rumors. I'm assuming you met Mr. Liam? Yes, I have. I uh, got a, the opportunity to meet him uh, yesterday. Hmm. He runs the, uh, the, the town newspaper. Yo, yeah, the uh, the Blackwater uh, Gazette Ledger. is it? Blackwater Ledger. Ledger, Ledger, that's it. Like it, great name. Yeah, yeah, I talked with him for a little bit. Uh, seems like a straight shooter. He doesn't. He has some. He has a unique view on how to get things done, but. Hmm. He enjoys his paper. Well, oh, understood, understood. Yeah, well, you know, that's kind of how uh, a lot of a uh, lot of us journalists are. You know, there's no, there's no rhyme or reason to it. I suppose. Hmm. But I like it. To, it's good because I get a chance to meet folks and uh, you know get around, uh, let other people know about things going on, that kind of thing. No. Don't talk about that, please. I heard you're getting married. Oh. William. Well, congratulations. Yeah, you congratulations indeed. This is celebrating times. You and Miss Alex, huh? William, no. Oh, is it? Oh, did something happen between you two? Nothing happened. She thought that because I took that peppermint from the game, apparently that meant I needed to marry her. I don't know what oh. backwards state she grew up in that that was supposed to be some ritual, but I, my wife's been dead for eight years and I don't intend to remarry. And I told her oh. that up front. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I, I, know who I, I was thought this... out with it? That, that cheeky little bastard, Zofia. She always Zofia has it in for me, I it? swear. Oh, uh oh. Lord. Oh, well, I'm I'm sorry. I, I thought it was something to celebrate. I apologize. No, it's not, but... Well, it sounds like a misunderstanding. Yeah, it definitely does. Oh, oh, poor, poor Miss Alex's heart is probably broken as well. To be frank, my dear, I don't give a damn. Good stuff. Good stuff. Anyway, how how are you getting on, William? Heard you got a bit of contact with the wrong end of a weapon. Uh oh. Uh, twice actually. Yeah. Uh -oh. I got shot by the bollards, and then once again on accident in uh, 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 Valentine. But I'm I'm feeling a little better. Um, I'm just trying to, you know, keep myself together after after all that. Good lord. Bollards seem to be uh pretty active from what I'm hearing. No, what happened? Apparently the bollards nabbed him. When? Hurt him pretty bad. He's in the medical tent right now. Good lord. I, excuse me. Let me go give him my best. Yo, yo. Yeah. Yo, go for it. Hans and them are over there, I think. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well, that comes full circle then. Because uh, when I came into town, they were looking for him. Yeah. 
Yeah, no. If, if they hadn't found him by now, yeah. they would have been they would have been sent post in ten thousand dollar bounties. Ten thousand. Good lord. Yeah, that. I I don't I don't normally say this, but Mr. Draven is essentially the equivalent of the town dad in some respects. Oh. He does a lot of medic work free. He's very compassionate to people in town. Jesus. You'll, you'll very you'll very rarely find anyone that has an issue with him. That's much more than a misunderstanding. Hmm. So when he was taken, a lot of people immediately mounted up and rode out. Whoa. Yeah. Well, yeah. that sounds like they were uh, uh, going for that kind of thing. Perhaps. You know. You know. You know. To I've had rile up. With these gentlemen myself, and I seem to think of it as a bit of a game, but they also seem to view it as a philosophy. Well. Yeah. They, believe, they told me that they believe that this is a free country and they should do what they feel they should do. Well, what they should do, and that's. Well, that's that's one interpretation of the word. Yeah. I don't know if it's a the right one, but uh, you know, I guess to each their own. Well, for all seriousness, sir, there is no right one. That's why it's called freedom. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Good point. Good point. Yeah. Well put. It just means that there's no certain. I don't know. Yeah, I well, think I'd rather take that over. I'd rather take uncertainty of opinion over certainty of tyranny. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, uh, I don't know. I've been reading. Uh, they're having a lot of problem with the anarchists over in uh, Europe. Yep, the Russians are having some issues too. Yep, yep, yep. Well, it, it, you know, it's everywhere. Get to get that uh, telegraph line in, and uh, you know, next thing you know, everybody's uh, coordinating, and uh, uh, not always in the best way. Yep. I guess it's the times we live in. Fortunately, it appears that way. Just connected enough to know when th things are bad, not connected enough to know how bad. Yeah. Well, that's part of why I want to, you know. Document it, write it down, get it out there. That way, uh, people in the future maybe uh, can avoid such problems. Here's hope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you uh, you 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 throw down seeds, and uh, you hope that uh, there's some kind of result. Yep. I think I heard it once said, "Blessed is the man who plants the tree that he himself will never see." Solid. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Do you have a specialist story that you tend to chase, Mr. Oh. Uh, Stockton. Ryder? Stockton. Robert Stockton. Mr. Mr. Stockton. Yes, sir. Do you have like a special story? Like, are you a, an economist, a mechanicist, oh. a religious man? What oh, do you well. seek out stories on? Yeah, uh, uh, well, okay, uh, so here you go. Uh, basically, what happened is uh, I'm uh, helping out a friend uh, who uh, inherited a, uh, a business that, uh, you know, his uh, grandfather started uh, back, a, back a while ago uh, called uh, basically Publishing uh, Dime Novels. Hmm. And, uh, you know, I, uh, I had done some, uh, journalism in college and, uh, uh worked, uh, for a little while in, uh, some of the bigger newspapers and, uh, it wasn't for me, you know, uh, they, uh, they didn't, uh, like my style, I guess. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I, you, you take what you can. And, uh, this guy was, uh, offering me, a, a trip out here to, uh, cover of all things sports, which, uh, I know a little bit about. I've written a few things about sports. And uh, they sent us, well, they sent me out here to uh, cover uh, a National League, uh, rumor that the National League was uh, looking to open up a, a, a franchise uh, called uh, the San Denis Saints. And, uh, mm. you know, I get out here and uh, find out that uh, nobody, uh, most people don't even know what baseball is. You know, it's, it's a different world. Yeah, it's, it's different, that's so, for sure. Yeah, so, you know, I'm uh, kind of stuck out here uh, covering uh, what I can, basically. And, uh, you know, it, it, it seemed to me like the National League would be the perfect place for uh, for a team down here. 
Because, uh, like, from what you're telling me here with the ballers, uh, National League is a, a bunch of goons. Uh, they're a bunch of thugs who uh, party late, late at night and uh, just terrorize the towns they go to. And uh, this sounds like these guys you're talking about. Well, if these guys, these Nash, these these baseball players also shoot people, then I think they're one of the well, same. Yeah, yeah, I guess it, it's a little different out here, you know, like yeah, I said. Yeah, just, just a little bit. Like I said, it, it's, a, it's a different world. It, it's yeah. uh, not quite the same. Although, to be fair, what San Denis would consider a catastrophe black or it might be some minor incident. <laughs> yeah. It's, yeah. It's, just, it's, just a, it's just economy of ruin. Yeah, I, I got that feeling, uh, you know, because uh, I'd been there for a couple of weeks. And, uh, you know, to waiting for some kind of, a, you know, money to get back. And they just said, uh, you know, find something. So I'm following the story uh, that this guy told me at uh, the, the saloon there. I think it's called the Steel. And, uh, yeah, he said uh, he said that there was, a, a, like, a organized turtle racing going on. And I'm thinking, what, what the hell is that? And, uh, you know, uh, again, uh, another uh, lead that went nowhere. But, uh, you know, you, you you go after what you can. So it brought me kind of uh, to uh, the conclusion that uh, I should uh, just uh, go visiting towns and uh, meet up with folk. Hmm. Well, if you're still interested in the sports thing, there's apparently mm -hmm. some barrel racing event happening at Redford Ranch. Okay. When, uh, I'm not sure the time on that, okay. but certainly people will be able to inform you about that. Yeah, there's yeah. There's also a few people looking to set up some races of wagons, although I'm not certain, yeah. the certainty of that. Yeah, I'll tell you what, uh, I, I, I ended up uh, renting uh, uh, the uh, one of the uh, uh, the carriages, and uh, the, the like little buggies, that moves yeah. like a bat out of hell. Yeah, the, the little, the cheap little wooden ones, they do go pretty fast. Mm-hmm, yeah, and I'm thinking, you know, riding along the other night, that uh, this is a uh, uh, the things that go on out here remind me of uh, like ancient Rome and what the hell let's uh, let's get some cart racing going you know yeah yeah more than one person has thought of that we actually yeah. had an impromptu one yesterday oh, yeah? around the town no oh, excellent it, but in the plains and back into it excellent yeah well I was uh, uh, talking to a a, a a ranger out to uh, uh, out west there uh, his name is Abraham. And uh, he was saying that uh, that uh, there's a, a couple of great spots out there for uh, kart racing. Uh, yeah, he took me to one of them. Flat yeah, well, he took me to one of them, uh, like way, way out there, like as far as you can go on the map. And uh, there's a big circle, pretty much, that you can go around. And I'll tell you what, uh, the scenery there alone is uh, beautiful. Yeah, it's quite nice. Mm-hmm. The, uh, the, the area, though, uh, I, I don't know. It's kind of a long ways out there. So you'd have to, uh, uh, you know, uh, put up a pretty good, uh, pretty good prize put package. But uh, I think it could be done. Like, people out here would uh, maybe enjoy that. Yeah, it's, um, I, I, yeah, it's near Austin and near the San Luis is particularly beautiful. I've actually, we mm -hmm. actually got a group of us down across the river in New Mexico, surprisingly. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I uh, I'd kind of heard something about that. Like, uh, uh, there's a town over there or uh, something like that. There's the, as far as we could tell, the only settlement there is the fort on the border. Okay. There's not really, either, the only thing I can think of is that there are infinite amount of revolutions. A lot of their buildings got burnt or they took all the important metals and melted them down and yeah. farther in the south yeah well but, you know uh, yeah we we went down into the plain into the flatlands near the near a lot of the bigger rocks and basically walked all the way through as much territory as we could just waiting to see when the first person we'd see speaking spanish asked us what the hell we were doing <laughs> yeah, we didn't see yeah. anyone so then we turned huh. around and came back whoa what did yeah, it was uh it was an interesting uh it was an interesting experience. Fun as hell, but yeah. interesting. Otherwise. Damn, that, that sounds Too like bad. a... The only, the only detriment was that we had to walk because we couldn't get the horses to fjord the river correctly. Oh, okay. But we were but we were able to swim across the river fine, and we crossed on mm. our own foot. But 
Yeah, it was okay. It was a bit of a slow experience. But... Yeah, well, uh, anything good, you know, is going to take time. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's great. That, that that sounds like a real, real memorable, uh, memorable thing. Oh, it was. Mm. We just we were more expecting more settlements and whatnot, but we didn't see any. Hmm. Well, you know, there's always the future, and uh, like you said, uh, you know, they're, they're always having uh, government problems over there. So, you know. Yeah. I guess there'd uh, have to be a draw to it, and uh, there doesn't uh, isn't a huge one right now. There's lots of uh, lots of other good stuff. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I kind of understood that uh, there was a, a like a some kind of. A, sugar thing over there out of mexico yeah something like that uh, i don't know uh, they were getting a lot of uh sugar in from uh from the south and uh i don't know i guess i guess we're they're using it for uh you know like moonshine and stuff like that hmm. i could see that you know i haven't heard that i heard that there's some decent sugar decent sugar production on this island called guarma Oh, okay. Is that, so is Guarma? I, I think our Guarma was a Mexican territory, no? Uh, apparently, it's near Cuba. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's that's a ways. Yeah, there's a gentleman in San Denis named by the name of Silas Black who has a contract with a shipping boat. With a, he's got some contract with a shipping company. That basically, they if you pay him a certain amount of money, he'll make a spot where a crate would be and take you down there. The only problem is it's supposedly five hundred dollars is a starting price for a person. Starting that's price. One way. And that's one way. So yeah, you're stuck there. Way. Yeah. Well that doesn't sound like a, 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 a the basis for a, a good tourism. No, it's not. I have the feeling that he wants to kinda of keep people off it as much. But it doesn't mean people don't stop don't pay that. Well, Apparently there's decent uh, hunting on there, mm. fish and other wildlife that you can't find in the contiguous states. Really? There's a, uh, and bring back to the sugar, there's decent uh, sugar plantation fields down there that are run by a uh, combination of uh, Cornwall Industries and the Cuban military. Oh, uh, They've kind okay. of leased out parts of land, mm. and that's how they get a lot of stuff down in the San Dene, but... Okay. Apparently they, they they either do or don't mind. I don't know, but people were picking picking it and turn it into cane syrup and whatnot. So. Oh, okay. You know what? This might be what uh, what uh, what I was hearing. You know, it was a uh, it was a, a couple of uh, like local folk that uh, that uh, gave me this uh, this uh, this map and uh, said that there was something down there. But uh, yeah, yeah I, I think uh, this is the place you're talking about. Yeah, it's it's. Never exactly heard it be described as a pleasant place, but it's got its charms. Well, shit, doesn't sound like it, but uh, you know, that's uh, that's how some places are. Yeah. What How's are he you doing? Talking about out there, woman. I was just asking them where they're from, chatting away, seeing if uh, seeing what they're doing around. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, now I still owe Miss Jess a drink from earlier. Now she had my back back there. Fair enough. Treat people right. Yes. Yeah. You're here. Don't do enough of that. No, I'm fine. It's okay. <coughs> yeah, but uh, that's as far as I know about Guarma. I well, haven't visited myself. I always ask the question, why the hell would I want to go to a Cuban island when I got these maps? Yeah, well, you know, uh, that's uh, maybe kind of the thing that uh, I might be able to uh, get the uh, uh, the publication to cover. Yeah. Because uh, the home office, they're always looking for new stuff to put in the uh, this, uh, this month's issue. Yeah, it would be an interesting thing to get people to be aware of, especially yeah. if it either increases or decreases tourism depending <laughs> on how you ride it yeah either be a savage land or a paratropical paradise well you know uh, p there are people that uh, that uh, love that they you know they eat that up and they they love uh, adventure locations to you know, talk to this silas guy maybe uh, you know we could uh, get some kind of thing going with that 
Maybe. I've heard he's mo he resides mostly in San Denis, although he's a, mm. he has a bit of a reputation for being uh, pompous. I guess I should say. Okay. Okay. Well, you know, uh, uh, you know, uh, that's kind of the impression I get of a lot of the San Denis folks. Yeah. But I mean, this is this is to the extent to where it's almost comical. Okay. According yeah. To, according to according to town folk rumor, apparently. He was at a dinner involving quite a few business owners, and mm. they were all each asked to name two things they were thankful for. And he said, he said, one number one thing was money, and the number two thing was the breed of man. <laughs> so, well, that's kind yeah. of painting a picture of the man for you. Yeah, that definitely is. Uh, you know, that sounds like a. It sounds like the uh, uh, the jackasses that uh, back uh, back east. And uh, the kind of uh, conversations I hear going on uh, at their little uh, uh, events and things that they have. Yeah. Yeah, it's... Uh... Sandinese is an interesting place. It's mm -hmm. different kinds of people and dangers. Yeah, yeah, well, that's, uh, uh, you know, that's you're going to get that in a bigger city. Yeah, Blackwater has a little bit of that, uh, mostly just because Blackwater mm. people tend to think they know everyone and everything. Sure. And they decide immediately, like, kind of like a, a swarm of ants looking for honey, you know? <laughs> okay, okay. They, okay. They, they, a lot of them, it's, it's, it's a set, they can band together to do the most beautiful things, and they can band together to be the shittiest people to match. And there's yep. just enough people here that it doesn't take long to both spread and do. Okay, yeah, you know... You are, uh, you're describing Washington. It's a, a, I did a, a stint of political writing in Washington, and, uh, yeah, that's, that's, to a T, that's those folks. Yeah. <laughs> but, and uh... I've, I've never really been too much of a political person. I mean, I did the army for 40 years, but that was about my extent of my involvement with Uncle Sam. Oh, After okay. After that, I took my, I took my pension and paycheck, and I built myself a ranch in Oregon with my wife. Okay. All right, boss. I'm back. Well, welcome right. back. Sorry about Mr. the wait there. Uh, Mr. I'm so sorry. I'm terrible. Stockton. Robert Stockton. Mr. Stockton. This is mm -hmm. uh, Mr. Green. He's one yeah. of our newest employees. Yeah. We uh we met uh, twice now. Yeah. Oh. Well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There you are. That's good to see you back. How's he doing over there? He's, uh, he's, he's doing a lot. Anyway. I guess, I guess, uh, I guess sweep up a bit. Okay. okay. Yeah. Oh, I think, I uh, well, Mr. Stockton, it's been, uh, it's been a pleasure, but I think mm -hmm. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna head off shift and maybe go out and hunt for a little bit before I go to sleep. Okay. So. Yeah, I understand. I, I do it's a, a lot of. Pleasure uh... talking and meeting with you, and I hope you find some find some good stories on your travels. We'll do. Don't 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 worry about not don't worry about threatening me for anything. Besides to quote that, just just use it to help you along. I don't know. I'm not really a man to have my name in paper. No, no, no. Yeah, everything's anonymous. Yeah, hey, uh, real quick. Take care. Yeah. All right. I think we're good. Yeah. Of you, we are not gonna be, you know, requiring you to set your Watch one of the deputies let a fella out of jail. There we go. Silas Black. Guarma. That is, uh, like it or not, it's a place that I should go to. Albeit it's one way. But that's how it goes. Uh, do -do. Yeah, really? Mm, no, I gotta hit the, there. So... Yeah. That's what I need for that. You hear 
sure about that old ranch. Very small, but hit very hard. She does hit hard. Excuse me? Yeah, hard hit. Cool stuff. I guess I uh, wanted to uh, get to a couple of things out of that. And uh, yeah, like I said, the Guarma thing is uh, probably a good idea at some point. Maybe not now. Uh, I don't know if this is going to work. Well, we'll give it a try. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. Last time this didn't go well. Cross your fingers, chat. All right. Cool. They did make it so that it spawns elsewhere. Excellent. Yeah, the problem I ran into last time was that uh, the vehicles had spawned, and then when you drop in, it drops you right on top of the previous vehicle and uh, flips over your cart. So that isn't uh, going to work. All right, uh, here's the thing. We are uh, going to head on over and uh, pick up uh, some more bait stuff for uh, later because that's kind of what we do is we go uh, from the two different locations. But uh, I wanted to do this, and then uh, we're going to head out west again. And uh, let me, let me, uh, let's see here. It should be... I've been kind of keeping an eye on the light. Yeah. We uh, we should be able to get out there by daybreak. Is kind of the plan. Or at least that's what I was kind of going for this round. Um, before we get to that, though, let's, uh, let's get to some place here because I need to... Uh, to take a real quick AFK break. Let's get away from main traffic areas. Dude. Uh oh, okay. A little bit of a clip there. Damn, I love this buggy. Okay. It'll work. Uh, we'll take a, a couple of minutes here, and uh, we'll be right back with a more HC Dime Novel uh, issue number four, and uh, we'll see where this goes. Uh, hold on, let's let's try something here. I wanted to um, let's see if we can find a good uh, good way to do this. Maybe this way, like this. No, this. Uh, I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get the cadence down a little bit better. There it is. Okay. Eh, close enough. All right. Like I said, uh, I'll need a minute here, and uh, we'll be right back. Uh, cover for me, chat. We'll be right back.
that's good stuff. Welcome back. Thanks for uh, waiting and uh, appreciate you being around for uh, tonight's harmless content. Dime novel. Uh, pretty cool. We met a bunch of people there in Blackwater and uh, looks like there's a group of folks getting together doing stuff, kind of meeting each other. Um, let's see here. Get this. And this. There we go. Um, and, uh, yeah, we got a chance to uh, meet up with, uh, uh, the, uh, aspiring deputy. Uh, and also, uh, the, uh, the other, uh, bartender there. I'll have, to, I'll have to go back in the VOD and get the names again. Uh, server schedule for restart in four minutes. Uh oh. That was the other thing. Fairly certain I was gonna have to do this. Uh oh. Let's uh, find a place we can get down. There we go. But uh, yeah. Uh, Mika, thank you. That was it. God, yeah. I uh, I believe I have heard that name before as well. From uh, somebody else here in town. Whoop. Keep from crashing into things. It's interesting. That was a new uh, a new server uh, admin notice. <laughs> sure. It works very well. We need a we need a place to ditch ourselves. Whoop. There we go. Skirt. <laughs> Could crash into everything. All right. We need to uh, bop on out here for a sec. So let's go to this. Here we go. Plus, I think I just ran through a bunch of people. And in there. There we go. Okay, we are. We're clear. Uh, once again, thanks everybody for joining me. And uh, again, thanks, Doll, for catching that. <laughs> I appreciate it. I meant to go write it down and then things happened and stuff. <laughs> I need this. Wow. Seriously, people. How much attention do you need in one lifetime? <clears throat> Uh, got a minute here um yeah thanks again like i said everybody joining me here tonight for uh the dime novel uh and uh, again i did want to apologize to anybody that uh, jumped on over to the channel last night if you got a, a notification uh yeah i i kind of ran into a thing and uh i was uh, uh trying to uh do a uh a crossover thing and it didn't work it doesn't work um, but, uh, I did get a chance to, uh, and you can go check it out there on Trek Radio Official. Uh, we got a, uh, a, a stream in for, uh, HC Space, uh, a couple of hours of, uh, Star Trek Online, which was, uh, interesting. I haven't, uh, played that in quite a while, so it was fun going through the stuff, taking a look at it. Uh, we played one mission, we got a, we got through a mission, and, uh, there's so much more story stuff to do. Uh, so looking forward to, uh, checking that out again, uh, next Thursday. But, uh, in the meantime, I did want to, uh, do a bunch, bunch of streams. Okay, there we go. Get, uh, a, a little bit more into, uh, the world here. Oh. No? Try again. Okay. 
Okay, we'll give it a second. Giving me some guff. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, well, that's why. We're uh, 27 of 37 in the queue, so it'll be a few minutes before we can get started. Uh, which I, I think actually puts me at a point here where uh, I should probably grab something to eat. And uh, a little bit more as far as drink goes. Because uh, it's going to be a few minutes. And uh, we'll uh, we'll take another break <laughs> and uh, get back in. I forgot that uh, if I don't jump in right away, it uh, becomes a thing. So uh, we'll take a uh, we'll take five ten minutes. I think it'll take about ten. Yeah. Wow. They're just piling in too. So uh, yeah, it's Friday night. You know, that's kind of the other thing about this is, is that I think this is well, this is definitely my first Friday night. Uh, I've done a Friday, I believe Friday afternoon-ish, uh, is usually when I play. Um, but, uh, for the Dime Novels, uh, I wanted to, uh, get it, get the first, uh, first week of Dime Novels in, uh, at least on a Friday night, uh, and, uh, see some of the folks there. Uh, we, uh, ran into a couple of, uh, the streamers that, uh, that I like to watch, and, uh, got a chance to, uh, uh at least interact, uh, briefly. Uh, with them and uh, I definitely recommend you guys check out uh, some of the other PRC streamers uh, it's a really great group of uh, folks that are, are doing a lot of work creating things and uh, it's a lot of fun to watch uh, definitely part of the definitely the reason that uh, that I'm uh, getting um, Robert started here on uh, PRC is uh, yeah definitely due to uh, the stuff that I've seen people doing. So, uh, you definitely want to make sure you check it out. Uh, don't forget you can, uh, we have that. I know we have that. Do I just have it as, uh, I think that's it. Yeah, there it is. Want to keep up on your stories, my stories. Uh, there's, uh, yeah, that one's the old, that's the old one for the Wild RP streams. Um, I need to, uh, make one for, uh, the, uh, for the PRC ones. Uh, but that'll at least get you there. And then up on the top left of, uh, the Hazroot screen, you'll find, uh, uh, where you can sort by server. And, uh, you'll be able to see, uh, the other folks that are doing stuff, uh, right now, uh, in the, in the, uh, on the server that we're on. Uh, which, uh, here, let me, uh, let me just do this. We'll make it easier for everybody. There we go. This one here. That's the, uh, like I said, that's the, uh, uh, there we go. That's the sort for the PRC one. So, uh, yeah, I highly recommend, um, when uh, when you get a chance to, if you want to do uh, uh, take a look at a couple of streams at the same time, this is the place to go, and uh, you'll uh, you'll be in good shape because uh, you can see everybody that's currently streaming. Which damn, there's a bunch of people streaming tonight. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, there we are. Okay. Down on the bottom there. That's cool. So, yeah, you can see uh, my streams on there, and then uh, everybody else that's uh, currently streaming from this server will be shown there as a uh, clickable links. And, uh, yeah, there's a couple of couple of the ones that, uh, that I like to watch are in here uh, that are currently on tonight. So definitely check, uh, check out the folks you see there. And uh, I'm not going to tell you who. I'll let you find out who you like. In the meantime, I'm going to take uh, 10 minutes here and uh, grab something to eat and uh, leave you guys with uh, uh, some more of the uh, ep uh, epidemic sound stuff. And actually, you know what? I'm going to... No, 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 no. No. 
here we go okay so yeah check this out you guys might enjoy this uh this is uh some arcadey type stuff that i found like i said i'll be back in about 10. hopefully uh we'll see you if not understand have a great night
Okay, so that might not have been uh, Western-themed cowboy music, but uh, it was uh, something different uh, for the break. Uh, welcome back, and uh, thank you, thank you, thank you for uh, joining me on the uh, live stream here on uh, Twitch and YouTube tonight. Uh, we're doing H.C. Dime Novel, issue number four, uh, The Times is uh, the subtitle there and uh let's see here Doo -doo -doo. how about this there we go um yeah i don't even think i'll even sum anything up on that we uh we learned quite a bit of uh good stuff and uh looking forward to uh, actually heading out west Do -do. After we drop into reality. Once again, my favorite moment. Wonk. Everybody. How are we doing? Alright. <clears throat> so like I said, thanks to everybody uh, watching. Hanging out in chat. Uh... Thank you to uh, Gigi Hick, bringing on by Alteran, and oh, Kachunk. All right. The is restarting. It just went chunk. Uh, uh. Oh, there you go. There's George. Still hanging out by that fire pit. Doo -doo -doo. All right. I'll just throw it over to that. We'll get this going. Ooh, zero of 128. Yeah, that's the thing. Uh, 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 let me take a look. What's the other thing that uh, <laughs> that I I need to uh, to look into? I need to get the stream avatars running again. I don't think I have it set up in uh, in this. Uh, particular thing yet. Yeah, it's not in here. I'd have to, I'd have to pull it. Uh, I'd have to do a bunch of crap. But uh, for future stuff, especially when uh, when I'm going to be doing these streams here, where we're going to hit the uh, server reset time, uh, we'll uh, we'll get that going again. I don't think there's been any updates or changes to it, but uh, eh, what the hell. It's fun watching the little guys run around. Uh, okay. Woof. Well, we're back. We're at the very back of the line this time, though. It is what it is. Uh... Yeah, well, 
We definitely have a while to wait now. But that gives us the opportunity, I think. Yeah, I better hold off on that too. But uh, yeah, it looks like they're filing in. Um, taking a look here. Events, public events. Okay, yep. All right, so Micah was telling us about, I think it was Micah, was talking about the barrel racing. And uh, I see it in here. Uh, what the hell? I'll just read it to you. Uh, barrel racing time trials at Redford Ranch are back. Uh, there is not a monetary purse this time. This is purely for practice. Uh, but come down uh, for a good time. Hosted by head wrangler Tyler Roan. So, Redford Ranch. Uh, tomorrow, 12 a.m. Oh. So that's coming up tonight. Redford Ranch. I think we have a we have a target location. If we can get in in uh, the next twenty six minutes, no, that's okay. We can catch at least some of it. Uh, let me see if I can pull up. Oh, we're waiting. Like I said, I mean, I'm currently 42 of 48 right now in the queue. And when we started this, I was 60-something, uh, 60 62. So, you know, it's moving. It, it's not going to take that long. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get over to it and uh, take a look. At least see what, uh, what that's all about. Uh, Redford Ranch Barrel Racing. Redford Ranch, formerly known as McFarland's. Okay. We are actually, as uh, luck would have it, we are headed that way. So, not too far away, but uh, we'll see. Their server stability will be uh, obviously an issue. And let's see. We've got currently... Uh, 38 people have gotten in and there's 44 left to get in. And I'm number 30. Uh. But, uh, yep. Yeah. This will be a, a thing sometimes. Alright, and then we'll head over to McFarland's. Like I said, we are currently pretty close. I've made this run a few times now. Um, so, yeah, it'll be uh, interesting to go back out there. Although, I think 
it would be wise to take the horse because the cart will be cart would be fun but uh we have to uh we have to remember that uh, if this is going to be like a public event type thing that uh we want to try to keep the number of things that uh, are going on there down and so what i'll do is uh we'll run out there with the uh we'll take ob out he's getting kind of lonely because i've been uh i think the last couple of times i've been on i've been playing around with the cart Plus, he's got the rest of the, uh, <laughs> the fish bait on him, which is always kind of funny opening up my inventory and seeing all the <laughs> worms and stuff while I'm sitting at the bar there. <clears throat> okay. Well, good. We're down to 14. But, uh, yeah, like I said, uh, thanks for watching, and, uh, thanks for lurking, and, uh, thanks for joining in the chat. All of that is, uh, very appreciated. And, uh, definitely, uh, he's getting this thing going back again. Uh, pretty, pretty straightforward. We're down to ten. This is, by the way, the uh, the music uh, that I had kind of uh, recently added to the uh, Ghost of Tsushima uh, soundtrack that uh, putting together for uh, uh, starting that back up again on uh, Mondays. We'll be doing uh, the HC Media Presents and uh, getting back into Ghost of Tsushima just because, man... I really want to, uh, to keep moving that story along as much as possible. Okay, let's see. Where is that? Okay, down to four. That'll work. We can work with that, right? Um, oh, that's right. Uh, Fingers crossed. Here we go. To drop into reality again. So there is that. I mean, that is a big bonus. Almost. Probably doesn't help there's so many things here. 
All right. Here we go. Give a sound. All good. Ground and moving, chat. That's a good start, right? So many times I've gotten actually pretty good at it. Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> yeah, kind of the color scheme I went with was uh, I wanted to uh, have the not not directly white white, but uh, kind of this grayish white. Great looking horse. Uh, I'll put out there a little bit. Cleaned up. Oop, there it goes. Nice. Yeah, I, I dig it. It is a really beautiful, uh, beautiful uh, creature. All right. Uh, we wanted to uh, put some stuff away. Like, uh, crayfish. And crickets. Oh, I thought I had... There it is. Sometimes the, uh, the way that it flips reason causes my brain to short circuit <clears throat> but then that may be other things there may be outside factors I'm just saying all right uh McFarland's ranch that's uh this is <laughs> if, if those of you are watching uh I think it was the second time novel that uh, that the wolves got me um this is where it was at and rightfully so because i had uh, turned away from the computer for like 30 seconds and came back and they were feasting on him um although i did kind of uh, i was starting to have a little bit of fun with them and uh the uh, manager there uh, at the ranch <laughs> rode up while i was being chased around by them and uh, promptly took care of the wolf problem. Um, but yeah, it's uh, 
it's kind of a cool spot. I always like this because it's a uh, it's halfway like it's the midpoint uh, between uh, the two sides of the map, and it's a uh, it's definitely you can feel the terrain changing. birds are working much better like to the point where I was a little disturbed um, earlier I was uh, out fishing and I actually saw what appeared to be like a an eagle or a hawk uh, dive bomb the river in front of me and damned if it didn't pick up a big ass fish now <laughs> that may have been the uh, the moonshine that I had that I had before, uh oh, before I went out there. All right, let's take you off of auto run. That was worrisome. <clears throat> Big old chunk. Plus this is just, it's another one of those areas that showcases how great the game looks. <laughs> we were definitely in a hurry.
Hello? How are you? How are you doing? Good, good. I, uh... I'd heard that there was going to be a, uh, a barrel racing somewhere around here. Oh, yeah, back on the ranch behind us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and uh, so I wanted to, uh, you know, make sure that my horse was, uh, uh, you know, uh, in a nice place out here. Oh, all right. Yeah. Yep. We was just uh, scouting around because the Bollard gang uh, done <sighs> murdered Captain Riggs not a uh, oh, no. half hour ago. Whoa. That's crazy. I, uh, yeah, we, uh, they, we were just talking about him. Uh, it was uh, back over in uh, Blackwater. And, uh, yeah, they were uh, talking about those guys. So, uh, oh. they around this area then? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, okay. Yeah. Well, I'll keep an eye out. Yeah, why Thank don't you. you go and uh, go with the rest of the guests at the ranch? Okay, yeah, yeah, definitely. That is, uh, you don't want to be out here, uh, Great idea. Someone made a mistake here as a bollard, or uh, yo, you could get napped by the actual bollard. So either way, you're in yeah. a shitty situation if you're <laughs> sitting out here. Yeah, no kidding. None of those are uh, what I want. Uh, yeah, I was just looking for the horse races. So yeah, I'll uh, I'll take that in mind. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Yeah. Yep. No problem. Let's <laughs> see. So we just about walked into that one, eh? Great. And we're goofing around that way. There we go. Looks like some folks are there. <laughs> I thought so. I kind of, I kind of thought that I was headed in the wrong direction. But like, as you can kind of see, that was. I mean, that was. Am I wrong? That was like cinematic as all hell. So I mean, I had to keep going, and uh, sure enough. I was just wandering off into the wastelands to uh, to be kidnapped or uh, horribly maimed. That fits. That fits the narrative. <laughs> Alright. Let's try out here. Like I said, I'm really trying to make a point of uh, keeping the horse out of, out of the area. <clears throat> Yeah, so I think we can see why the law are busy, right? They uh, they killed the captain, apparently. Well, oh, shit. I think I have an alibi. Oh. there i just went ah mr robert how are you no hey how you doing um doing good excellent excellent i see you got my telegram about the uh, sorry yes sir Bell races. yeah yeah i didn't respond to it i i uh uh i apologize that's okay yeah i get i got caught up and you know stuff yeah yeah excellent well good to see you i've uh, been looking forward to this yeah it's a uh, it's a favorite uh, hey, well, welcome to Redford Ranch. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Thank you. This is uh, Tyler. He organizes. I'm the, the guy on the horse, and I'm the head mm -hmm. of the horses here. Belly room. Yeah, the guy on the green. Yeah. Good to meet you. Yeah. It was uh, uh, 
got a notice of this uh, uh, in town. I was over in Blackwater, and uh, they mentioned this. Mm. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I had to get out here. Check it out. Yeah, we're definitely going to need, uh, unless Lee McCarthy shows up with the barrels that we need, we're going to need volunteers to be barrels. And I think uh, Frankie might be our first volunteer because she's really good being run over by horses. So. Oh, Whoa. oh I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <Excellent. Demarcus. laughs> Okay. She swung on Maxwell. Jesus. Uh, and I think Flo's our second volunteer for just randomly she punching Maxwell for no reason. So. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm okay. Sorry. Uh, sorry. It's, uh, it's fine. That, that was the I first time I ever it. ever oh, did that. <laughs> and Hans is our third volunteer for banging yeah. out oh, against Hans, the porch. Hans All right. Oh, yeah. again. It's not like I'm going to be beating my own record anyway. So. Oh, don't brag, Hans. Wait, what is your record? Yeah, Hans, has the, Hans has the world record at the at the barrel races here. I think what was it, like twelve fifty seven? I think. Damn. Some, some twelve forty seven. Excellent. Yeah. And... I don't know why I got in your holes. <laughs> it's okay. I have that effect on men. Um. <laughs> not, oh yeah, I I'm guess you should be the one. first ones to know. Uh, yeah, Colton and I are engaged now. What? Yay! Yeah. yeah. Aww, so cute. <laughs> yeah. He proposed to me a week ago now. No. Aww, that's sweet. Aww. Yeah. Wedding. Wait, was that the day I was really going down? <laughs> gay wedding. Uh, Have gay you the wedding. flower Thank girl? You. I mean, you're already fruity enough, Frankie. I what? Frankie. You're already fruity enough, Frankie. Yeah. <laughs> No. I have to be fruity to you be, don't the need to be the flower girl. girl. Brock, what'd you want? No, I'm saying you're fruity enough. You don't need to be the flower girl to be even more fruity. <laughs> I think your horse ran me over really hard, and I hit my head because I don't understand. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm waiting for Colton and Joe to get back, so at least we can like have hands here to help out with everything. But. Mm. Oh, all right, well. The shame that is having to wait for the barrels. Yeah, I'm going to wait 10 minutes, and if they don't show up, we'll, we're going to have to take volunteers from the ground. <laughs> all right. Oh, wait, Frankie, you're going to be one barrel, right? Oh, I wanted to do the racing. I mean, you can Never switch out with before. people. Okay, I guess. Can, yeah. I'll put myself in, in uh, another position to get trampled. Cool. You all right? I'm on the roof right now. Okay. I'm okay, I just slipped. Yeah, I see. I should have known that was cool. What does that mean? You're just the type of person to climb on the roofs, you know? I mean, yeah, everyone knows that. That's what I said that. She's like a raccoon. A bandit. Yeah, like a little possum. I am a bandit. And a pirate. Oh, yeah, because you're part so you of Carl LeDuc's fucking oh. gang. Where is Carl? Yeah, I'm his gang, I think. You're in a gang? Yeah. Carl LeDuc. Little shithead. Quite little, <laughs> quite shithead. I met him and he said he was in a gang, so I said, can I join? And he said, yes, yeah. so now I'm in a gang. Wow, that yeah. easy, huh? I guess so. Can I be in a gang? Mm. Yeah, I'll let you into the gang. So I can join the Le Duke gang? I think I can do that. Oh, no, no one one said I couldn't. Grim Hunters are not a gang, alright? It's a society. I know, I know they're not a gang. I know they're not they're a gang. They're already a, a group of people like you, uh, you dedicated right your time to, is it not? No, I don't do that. Over there. Uh, oh. Over there. Oh, it might be one of those uh, situations where you see it. Yeah, I thought, I thought so. I'm just gonna go rope it and let it go because I don't know whose horse that is. Ugh. Howdy. Oh, no, never Howdy. mind. I walked near it and it stopped bucking, so we're good. Well, I can't see it, so it's probably a demon horse. Hey, buddy. Oh, it is a demon. I really like the race so far. It's the red and white one that's literally right here in front of me to the left. Hello. And the one that looks like uh, like meat. Yeah. 
I can't uh, see it, but it doesn't have a saddle. Did she say it looks like me? Can you hear me? Yeah, it looks like me. Yeah, she said it looks like me. Mm. I was losing its shit for a while there, so. Yeah. Be careful. <laughs> and it's losing its shit again. Hey, Colton, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Don't get hit. Who people? Maybe he's in his head. Master Goggles, oh, wakey right wakey. Right Oh, we can't hear him. I think that's the issue. Oh. William. Hello. Yeah, we can't hear you. Please don't jump the fence. We got the laryngitis. Uh, where's the uh, Where's the gate at? The gate is right over there. Okay, I guess. The gates are just optional. The suggestions. That's That's not true. Is legally written the rules of this ranch. If you if you jump the fence, you get shot. So, oh. sir, you know the fence oh, is broken. All right. Oh hi, William. Everyone, everyone who's interested in the barrel races, please meet in the corral in the middle of the paddock over there, and we will get sign up started. And anyone who's interested in being a barrel, since we don't have physical, oh wait, we do have physical barrels. That just <laughs> that just happened That's without me noticing. <laughs> so many bells. Uh, uh, Sorry, can you hear me? Well, I don't know what to do in this situation. Just wanted to talk well, to. Well, if you can oh, hear us, so we'll can just. Uh... Yeah. So, uh, like I told you earlier, there's a lot of situations with the ballots going around it. Like to, you know, just kindly ask uh, to see some proof of identification. Since we're the Rangers in your in New Austin, we haven't seen your face around, so not for personal. Just, uh, there's a shootout and our captain got murdered. You know how to give your ID. Ah, uh, Colton, uh, can you search yep. this man? So, uh, Mr. Colton here is just gonna reach into yeah. your pockets and look for Please your ID. Please don't catch you if your horse is uh, unstable. Just Please make sure you horses. ask for it, that's all. Is that okay? Yep. Make sure you step back, Rook, so that he doesn't oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. ask you for ID. No, no, he, uh, he, he nodded in affirmation. Okay. Uh, no, I meant uh, all right. just in case Colton oh, oh, yeah, accidentally yeah. searched your pockets. Yeah, I'll be kind of straight. Alright, I appreciate like it, sir. Mm. Hey, you didn't have to put your hands up, you're good. You can put your hands back down. You got it. Take just your arms try not down. to, uh... Just try not to, um... It just looks like you're sneaking around when you're that far outside of town, and, uh... We just had a, a shootout we did. Colton, what's the name? Uh, Robert Stockton. All right. Pleasure to meet you, Robert Stockton. Sorry that we yeah. had to uh, meet under this circumstance. I definitely wish it was better. Oh, press ID. All right. That's a lot of folks in here. Oh, oh so he's geez. a reporter. Hi. Did you just speak, sir? I no, think his voice is broken. Him. Thought it was him. He could be mute. No, no, he spoke all, all earlier. Maybe okay. he just got a frog in the throat. All right. Okay. Oh, he's a sports uh, reporter. Okay. Yeah, it would make sense. He is here for the uh, thing. Uh, Colton, did you write down his ID? Colton? Yeah, I got my notebook here. One moment. You remember all the numbers? No, I don't. All right, sir. Can you please show Colton Sorry the ID one more time? You don't have to pick your hands up. It's okay. You yeah, you're, you're not, not under, under arrest or in trouble. Under arrest or anything. You just make sure you write that down every time uh, you ask for identification. God, I've never done this before. It's fine. It's just a uh, in case this man does turn out to be a dirty bullard scout. Uh, 
We'll remember in the future. Not that you are one, sir. I would ask him to take his hat off so I could see his hair, but it doesn't matter. Wait, what is the matter? Well, you know, Archibald. Oh. All right, thank you again. Thank okay. you, sir. I hope you enjoy the event. I yeah, hope we didn't take event. too much of your time. Hope we can read some of your stories soon. Hopefully you get that frog Marshall. out of your throat, too. Mm -hmm. Liam. Hey, so you need help. Hey. You look like you're about to faint. You see where Marshall went? Yeah, that certainly looks that way. Okay, let me... All right. I'll let you all know. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea what's uh, going on there. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let me see. I'm pretty sure. I don't see it. There. Yep. Okay. Let's see if this works. Two words are good. There he is. Shoot somebody, maim somebody, and then they leave. Any better? Yep. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, we can hear you. No, shit. Yeah, I hit a big wad of something. Yeah, I don't know. I he was a yeah, sometimes, you know, your throat gets a little bit phlegmy. And it yeah, gets yeah. It was, there and, uh... it was weird. It was weird. But, uh, yeah, no problem. I totally understand, gentlemen. Of, uh, yeah, yeah. It's just we saw you, you know, skulking yeah, around. I didn't no want shit. to do the idea, but... Uh... Yeah, dude, and I'm, I'm skulking around out in the woods. Yeah, that's... I totally understand. And, uh... Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh shit. Uh oh. Well, that was the thing. Dang, call us blast water for no reason. Shit, that was the thing. Mm -hmm. Over with me. What kind of son of a bitch? Wow. I got one. Okay, field medic. Got your yeah, knock the shit out of me, though. Damn. Put him on the pot. That's uh, that's a deaf kitty. If you never mm -hmm. heard of them. Yo, yo. Colton, can I speak to you real quick? Yep. So, uh, how long have you been in the state for? Oh, uh, well, I've been uh, I've been in the state for a couple of weeks, but uh, mostly over in uh, Saint Denis. Uh, oh. Yeah. How's how's life treating you over there? Eh, uh, I'm headed out this way. Uh, you know, it's it's getting kind of boring there. Oh yeah, no. Uh, there was a big event. Uh, mm. it's, it's only business people, like you know, big shot business yeah. groups. that's over there. Uh, other than that, most of the life you'll find is Valentine, Blackwater, and uh, occasionally oh, oh, New Austin. Right yeah. over here. Yeah, I've been uh, kind of doing well, the circuit. Oh, get Liam. Sorry, sir. I've go got to go. Well, yeah, Liam. go ahead. Go ahead. Hanging out with the law. Hello. I'll talk to, I'll talk to you soon. I'll be right back. Hello. 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 Yeah. Oh. What? 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 Beam what? 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 Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the other. Right. We're going checking it out. What's going on? How do you guys? You guys hear me? Can can? I know it might not actually. You might just be lurking. But, uh, yeah, if you guys can hear me, give me a thumbs up. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Uh, this should be interesting. Looks like they got the barrels, I think. 
figured I'd throw myself out there so that Probably, I could I write, know. you know? Cats are kind of like unpredictable. You know? They kind of they kind of come out of nowhere and they're like, I'm going to do what I want. That's a great location. Especially for this kind of thing. This is what I was hoping that uh, we'd catch. I mean, if they're excited to see everybody, it's not really that special, is it? <laughs> if you can make friends with the Okay, you make yeah, friends we're going to have a food issue. Oh, yeah. You ever seen somebody's friends with a cat? Hmm. Or do something about that. Well. Or wrong with being a wit? Shit. We're just going to go hungry. <laughs> it might be the ether. I, I thought I did a pretty good job. It was definitely testing my me shots. And uh, I think I, mean, I, I kind of got, un, un, got what I wanted out of it. And a pretty good way to, to run it. Right, is everyone else okay? Anyone else get hurt? No, I'm good, thanks. Only spiritually. Oh. All right. I'm trying to figure out how to salvage this. <laughs> um... What even happened? All right. Put this up. I just heard an angry cat and then a lot of gunshots, and I said, That's crazy. Turn it on. Oh, yeah. They're like, they're like sand colored or whatever, so they blend in real well with the ground. <laughs> just gonna keep walking around in weird circles here. That'll, what? That'll work. What was that? I ain't never seen one in the tree. It's kind of scary. What? What's a shark? What's it going? What's a shark going to do in the tree? Get there. Don't fish need like water or whatever? I don't think there's no water in the tree. is probably all of the law that's out here is standing right over there. <laughs> it was very cool. I get the whole shakedown and they got me on record. <laughs> like I said, I was joking at first when I said, you know, the whole thing about the, uh, I have an alibi, but then I thought about it. I'm like, no. Nah. Do I have an alibi? Really? Cool, it's starting to snow.
<laughs> yeah, no, I came up with a new area. I just I'm trying to get everyone to listen. <clears throat> All right, everyone who's interested in barrel racing, if you can meet in the center corral just so we can talk things over and establish a new plan and new uh, guidelines since we can't exactly do it in our normal place. Henry. Dusty, come back. Everyone just Dusty, gathers hurt. in the corral. Gotta keep an ear on what's going on. But uh yeah, I'm press straight up. Press pass. We're gonna move it over here. And if anyone has their horse out currently, could you please put it away? <laughs> no, I'm like because of the time. That's him there. No, oh, here he is. Ah, oh, this will work out great too. Put him right here, real quick. I'm stuck. All right. Tonight are not going to be concurrent with previous times because obviously everything's going to be a little bit different. So, our new entrance is going to be this gate over here, to my right, and we are going to time people as they enter and leave, and that will be the start and finish point. We are going to have three people barrels established over there, and I have worked with Henry Green back there to establish the new uh, barrels. So, if I could get three volunteers ah, from the crowd of cool. barrels, we will be able to be switched out, and we will work on make sure you can race.
work. I think. Try it. Damn. Well, good enough. Gets the idea across. That's all I want. Hey, thanks. Welcome aboard. Appreciate it. Island 64. Good to see you. And there we go. Happy dance. Thanks. Yeah. It's a kind of a pretty good soundtrack of stuff here. And uh, I definitely wanted to uh, come out and uh, catch this as it's going on. Ah, uh, the snow. Perfect. Yeah, there it goes. Somewhere. Uh, <laughs> okay. I, I could completely understand how that might happen. <laughs> yeah, man, I, 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 it's, it just has to be done. And it's such a good format for this. And uh, it, it fits in with the greater, greater story uh, that I've uh, been cooking up for quite some time now. But uh, yeah, it's a great opportunity to uh, to do this and uh, hang out here on uh, PRC while they uh, do their thing. And uh, just to... yes, sir. What's up? Uh, I'm not stuck around for these. I'm I'm, I'm a big fan of Red Fist Rodeo games, but uh, mm -hmm. something has called me to Blackwater. Uh, okay. Do you mind sticking around? And I will pay you if you you know record the winners and you know the. Oh yeah. For the times, the best times, you know. Yeah, yeah. I'd be happy to do that because I got to get right. that info anyways. So yeah, yeah, yeah. no problem. No problem. Uh, I'll see you in Blackwood if you're around still late today. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, uh, I think I got your, uh, I think I got your PO. So uh, yeah. I'll, I'll shoot you the, uh, the results. Yeah. Hold on. All right. Howdy. Howdy. All right. There we go. Now we've got to now we've got to do some now we've got to do some notes. We got notes, and uh, we got an emote to go with it. Um, let's see. I uh, as far as like uh, the voice, you, you uh, my regular voice. Um, I do a uh, the radio show on truckradio.net uh, called Harmless Content on uh, uh, Sundays at 10 p.m. and then uh, we do another show on Wednesdays. Um, I hang out to GG Hick, one of my mods here, uh, does a radio show over there and uh, I have slowly but surely eaten away at his radio show time in uh, a little segment where we talk about uh, games and stuff uh, that's going on, which I, no doubt this will be probably them this week's this week's new mid show. Oh, you met me in character. Okay, right on. Uh, wh what character do you play? Because, uh, yeah, I, uh... Okay, right on. Yeah, I, uh... I also, uh, uh RP uh, a character that I've done primarily over on, uh, uh, Wild RP, uh, called George, uh, or not George. Yes, George. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, right on. Right on. Okay. Oh, awesome. Yeah, you know what? I, I kind of wondered how your story went. Like, after after we parted ways, I was like, wow, that's cool. There's a, there's a whole, like, there's a whole part of this. Oh, okay. Excellent. Yeah. There's, a, there's some great stuff for uh, singers as well. Shit. I should uh, keep my eye on what's going on here. Uh, yeah, but, uh, there's definitely, uh, room to move. Uh, and, uh, you could definitely find, uh, some good RP in that, I'm sure. Right. And you get the, the winners, and, uh, the times. And, uh, hopefully not get eaten by a cougar. Yeah, right on. Um, yeah, I was, uh, like I said, I was, it was kind of cool. 
uh, meeting you there and uh, getting you moving All right, along. Can I get entrance to come over and line up in front of me so I can get your names down and we can get started? Sign me up as well, Tyler. Got you, Hans. He's gonna defend his own. Uh... Oh, that's right. I'm gonna take care of this. Yay! Get some food. Good on water. Okay. Uh, let's see. This will probably work best. Get the audio up. Really, another cougar. Mm hmm. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, any other entrance? Because we only have three. It's f okay. I hear that cougar now, too. Oh, tactical space. Oh, howdy. Sorry. Why does it sound so angry? <laughs> Get fucked up. All right, I think it's dealt with any other entrance because we only have three, and this is free, and this is for learning and practicing. So even if you've never barrel raced before, feel free to join up, and we will teach you how to do it. It's all right, Micah. I got you. It's just All right, so if I. Yeah, this is basically a learning map for anyone who is remotely interested in learning. Yeah. Uh, no, you got no, you don't stand. You're gonna get on your horse eventually when okay. I call you. All right, not not yet, not yet, not yet. Oh, 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 okay. Okay, is anyone else? Because we only have five entries, and again, this is free. Everyone can learn. It's very fun. It's very easy. Yeah, one like time it's... Leona entered. You can hear me. Because I, I told her to, and she fucking beat me. <laughs> uh, Jess, did, did Jess say she wanted to? Is that what I heard? Yep. Jess, why are you referring to yourself in the third person? Oh, <laughs> I know who you are. <laughs> All right. Uh, Nona or Colt or anyone who works at Redford, please. Virginia, you want to try it out? Anyone. Hey, we are open to entries. All entries. Oh. No one. Left, okay. I'm uh, we only have six entries, so seriously, anyone. Maybe keep it, it open. It is very easy. Oh, hey, Dustin, what are you going Friday and Saturday? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I guess, already asked you. I phone. guess, yeah, if you just, we'll just keep going and that build, next, no one wants to do it anymore. How about that? Yeah, I learned. Uh, uh, first up is Frankie. Yeah. And actually, you're welcome Jess, to come on over. over there's a, there's lots right. of stuff going on, yeah, as you can see. More, yeah. think, and uh, it's a great community. So they're they're left, super yeah, helpful. And I don't know if you caught my little little run in with the the law enforcement there. But uh, yeah, they're very cool. No, no, very dark, cool. Yeah, and New move back away from me at like 10 feet. I love you. There you go. All right. So, Frankie, if you want to go first and grab your horse, we can get started. Okay. And everyone, make but, sure you are uh, not uh, in front of the, the gate because that is where she's going to be riding out of in exit. Got it. And you do not want to be run over by a horse like she was. New no, York, it would be terrible. Trust me, I've been stepped on, a horse, stepped on by a horse. It ain't fun. Definitely not. Definitely not. <laughs> Uh, Micah and both of you guys actually. Hans is gonna be the first barrel, so she's literally gonna be turning right and galloping right here. So you guys are gonna get hit if you stand right there. Train. Oh, is that the train? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's a passenger train too. Oh yeah. I guess yeah. If you all want to get on the roof, the stables there is a hay bale to the right of me that you can use to jump up on the roof I and didn't. not get hit by horses. So. Colton, when the hell did you get a rabies? All right, we're waiting on Frankie. You're, you're way worse than Liam. 
Mm -hmm. I don't believe that. So Tyler, are you gonna are you you're gonna demonstrate it, yeah? Yeah, we're gonna inter I actually I'll just demonstrate it right now. Alright, Frankie, you wanna walk? Okay. So I'm just gonna demonstrate how this works. So you can have okay, a run and start one. if you want. Uh yeah, I'll just You know what? I'll just do it and if anyone has questions, do that. Alright. So you go on the inside of the barrel right here. That was a good corner. And then you gallop all the way to the finish line. Oh, it's a short track. It's very simple. It's very so easy. Outside, you do have to go outside, into or loop, go around the barrels yeah. in that specific way. So you go left on the first one. And that's where you go around clockwise. And then on the second one, which is that tree, you're also going to go. You're going to go counterclockwise. And the third one, which is uh, just back there, you're going to go counterclockwise and then gallop back as fast as you can to the entrance. And basically the goal here is to ride as fast as you can without knocking over our barrels. Because you don't want to run sense. over on. No, makes sense. Uh, this is basically a practice nut. There's no fun. There's no, like, purse. There's no... You're just learning the ropes and trying your best and preparing for when there actually is money. Uh, that was an advertisement, but it was just a practice night for <laughs> uh, right. There is no purse night. But yeah, so Frankie, you want to go first? Uh, I also recommend mm -hmm. that you do get a running start if you can, because it will dramatically help your time. Okay. Yeah. How far back so do you, you go? You can, you can start as far back as you want. Okay. I'll just tar timer when you enter these gates right here. Okay. I will count you down though, all right? Can you still hear me? Yes. All right, let me get my stopwatch ready. All right, Frankie, are you ready? Yep. Mm -hmm. Do you know the course? Do you need a refresh or anything? Mm, I think uh, I got it. Been around? I think you might be All right, on. yeah, and if you do it wrong, I mean, this is learning, so no harm, no foul. Oh, all right, it's right behind three, you. two, I found one, go. Got it, come on, we have a job, come on. Can we come with? No, you it's too right. There you go, Aww. girl. There you go. Yeah. All right, nice. Spur that horse. Come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Nice job. That is a great time. That is 14:21. That is not Woo. bad for her first time ever. Oh yeah. Uh, just so you know, our world record was like 12:47 by Mr. Hans Rimmel, so that's Ooh. pretty you know, close to that. Congrats. So. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. Uh, let's give everyone who wants to go three tries because there's so few of you. If you want to try to beat your own oh. time, Frankie. I'm gonna go again. Ooh, okay. Yeah, there's only six people signed up, so it's gonna be very short if everyone only goes once. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll go again. All right. Just you want that head start again, or you gonna start right there? Yeah, let me back up. All right. Uh, Who's on deck? I don't think I got far enough. Uh, Coral is on deck, so Coral, you have two more rides until ready, so just be aware of that, alright? Alright. Frankie, three, two, one, go. There you go. Killing it. There you go, there you go. go. Nice job. Yeah. All right, 1429, yeah. so close. Right. I think we've learned, uh, the people that are kind of veterans here, I think the best way to do it is not to turn tight. Like, try to keep wide turns and keeping your speed, because the tighter you turn, the slower your horse will go. Okay, but wider you also turns. Wanna, you all, but you also want to be close to the barrel, so you kind of have to gauge that yourself. If you're too far away, you get penalized. But I think with due to the fence being right there, it's kind of hard, because you're regardless, you're going you're gonna to be close to Hans. But, yeah. Um, so basically what you're trying to do is you're trying to get as fast as you can, staying relatively close to the barrels and not too far, but also staying wide enough the way so you maintain your speed, all right? Okay. Oh, makes sense. Yeah, it's it's a balancing act, but mm -hmm. it comes with practice. I'll do it one more time. Oh, all right. Never yeah, mind. yeah. Let me three try for everyone. All right. Three. 
two, one, go. Oh, hold on, sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah. you need to be on your horse to be all race. I mean, it might be fun um, to yeah, run around, but yeah, I get. <laughs> Timer's still running. Okay, sorry. You're good. Just he's, he's trying to go his own way. Give me, give me a second. Okay. You can go your own way. Sorry. Uh, all go right. Your mm -hmm. own way. <laughs> <laughs> two, <laughs> one, go. Nice. There you go. Yeah. Got there it. You go. Imagine trying to do this in a wagon. Right, look, uh, a lot there, Frankie. There. Darn it. There you go. Curses. Right, Nicely done, though. 70, but I think you know. Yeah. <laughs> Good recovery. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, Coral, you are next. And How folks, far usually back do I we, have to go? Find you can go as far back as you want. You can have a run and start on this one because we don't have that stall, so. But does it add more time or do you start it when I go uh, through no, the gate? No, I, I start it when you go through that gate. Okay. Yep. Yeah, folks, usually we do have barrels more properly set up and a clear okay. entrance and exit. Sure. So tonight we're just kind of doing what we can. All right. <laughs> Three, okay. two, one. Go. All right, spur that cow. Come on, cow girl. That is not a cow. That is a horse. There you go. It's a cow. A ten. Very good. There you go. Oh, 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 real oh, oh, oh. Come on, Coral. You're good. You're good. Nice job. Right. It's good run. Oh, okay. no, a rock. I didn't realize there was a rock over there. That's a rock. All right, what can we do about that? Um. Dynamite. Anybody got any dynamite? Mm. <laughs> oh uh, no! If only. I don't know what we can do the about Martian that. Take um, it from me. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I guess we could just make. Yeah, we could make the rock the barrel. Suggest doesn't have to be there. Yeah, how about we do that? Is everyone all right with that? Just making the rock the barrel for now. Sounds right. Weird looking barrel. Uh, that's a resounding yes. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, so that rock is going to be the barrel. Jess, you can come on in. Jess, you can Je uh, go back. They're going to make the rock the barrel. What a sweetheart. She might be in her head. No, no, no. She, You're just too far for her to hear. Oh, okay. It is very cold. It is definitely chilly. Ish. Yeah, the rock might be hard to see, but we also don't really have a choice. Eh, well, it's test run. The rock. <laughs> uh, yeah, she could just stand on the rock. Sorry, Stater. Good to go. Good to go. Good to go. Hey, is this right, uh, on right, the bridge right. over there? All right, all right, all right. Um, it's a guy on the hmm? bridge over there. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, uh, all right. You ready, oh. Coral? Okay. Yeah. All right. Three, two, one, go. Is that up there? I think it's one, I don't know. Uh, okay. Nice. Get a good one there. There you go. Uh huh. Like yep. You're giving pointers. What? I thought <laughs> you're giving pointers. <laughs> no, I said good turn. Just go oh, good turn. turn. Cow. Barrels don't <laughs> talk, Mr. Not bad. Not bad. That was 1809. Coral, you, I know you can do better. I know the cow's just not turning as well as you want tonight. Huh? He's just not listening. Well, tell, tell the cow to move hill? faster. That was terrible. Mike. Wow. Is the hill back there giving you, uh, is the hill back there giving you trouble or what's happening? Nope. I'm dying. Nope. She gets it. You killed me. The cow just doesn't nope. know the direction I'm trying to go, I guess. Maybe it's just All right. me. Uh, well, if it continues to be a problem, we'll have to find out something else, but, you know, we'll make it work for now. Uh, I don't know who that is back there. Uh, uh, uh isn't that Leona? There is a, do you not see the man back there on the horse that's right next to Jess? Yeah, of course. 
Who's that? Ah, How was Valentine. Pull your gun. Because I didn't know, right. and then when then it was the Pops threat it was the field. told not to be a threat, then I put it away. Okay. Well, you just think I saw something and went fresh meat? Hey, I, no, this is great. He's, a, he's supposed to speak to Luna. <laughs> you are crazy. I like that. <laughs> That's what they call me, baby Lou. Oh, is that so? <laughs> now they call me the shaman. Oh. Why do they call you that? Frankie. Because I'm a shaman. Oh. Hmm? Yes, you're Frankie. Yep. Shaw, man. I got it that time. No, just shaman. It's not, it's oh. one word. Oh. Yeah. Ask me what? Oh, that's the petition. Yeah. Coral. How dumb, oh. mother. Boy. Need another. Uh -oh. Yeah, you are. I think we're hitting, we're hitting bubbles. Wait, we need another barrel. Dead body is the rock. Yeah, you can go ahead and get ready. Uh, everyone, back Why away from the barrel, body? please. That is. I don't know. What the fuck is going on? Probably a van idea. <laughs> I ask myself that every day. All right. All right. Are you ready, Coral? I'm sorry for the delay. Yeah, I think so. All right. Three, two, one, go. And go. Nice turn. Nice turn. Mm-hmm. Wow, solid. I'm going to deploy it. All right. Nice job. Yeah. Uh, that was actually your best time, I think. Coral, that was 1608. And this blizzard is getting... This is getting bad. This is getting bad. In the right spot. Uh, yeah, Liam, if you can actually get a run and start if you want, just because you know this is basically unofficial, and why not? Fair play. All right, just count me down. All right. Hi, George. Three, two, Hi. one, go. I always. Oh, solid turn. Oh, damn. Nicely done. Now. 1507. Great time, Leaf. Oh, damn. I'm more of a situation filthy jokester rather than a pre premeditative jokester. I could do better. All right. You can get a better run and start if you want. Oh, not that bad. Thank you for those holding the lanterns, by the way. All right. Ow. Pretty sure. Right. <laughs> Three. No, I am quite fine. Go. It gets real bad like this up in Colton sometimes. All right, you're killing it, Liam. Come on. Get it. You got it. There you go. Go, go, go. There you go. 1342. Damn. Hot that damn. The time of the night right there. 1342. Fuck oh, yeah, damn right. That's real fucking quick. Oh, All right, Mr. Liam. Jesus, it's cold. All right, Liam, you get one more, and on deck is Micah. Micah, you ready? Wait, I got a joke. All right. Wait, I got a joke. I just thought of one just now. Three, Are you ready? two, two one, I'm go. We are called cheats or precision. Mm, solid corner. Go, 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 Nicely go. done. <laughs> Four, er, 1452. There you go. I love it. That kind of that kind of hurt me a little bit. <laughs> All right, Mikey, you're next. All right. You ever like? 
You feel like confident? You know the pattern now? Guys, you're so sensitive about their dicks. They all look weird, okay? I think I got it. Well, no, it's like Yeah, 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 that's it. This sounds like a bad time. You know what I mean? Three, two, one, go. Come on! Oh, okay, that's a start. Whoa. <laughs> it didn't go around on. Whoa. Oh. My God. <laughs> oh, he did? Okay. There we go. 1679. That's not bad. Not bad for your first time. Wait a minute. Okay, hang on. Let me see. So, I thought... Is William where Hans was? So much, man. I cannot hear you. Is William where Hans was? Oh, that is William. Okay, I thought that was Hans. Yeah, yeah I was going to no, say, there's someone Hans in the right, and it's not Hans, but... We can go over here, by the way. It's... Oh, right. Did Hans get right over? It's fucking yeah, William Ryan, okay? I know who it is, I just... Hans had been there for every other run, so he said that's not yeah, Hans. It's Hans, like, okay? Who else am I supposed to go around? Hans is doing medical. Um, someone slipped in the telephone, right? Oh, okay. Awesome. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, uh, Jesus Christ, it's freezing. There's always one person slipping up the roof. Yeah, this is fucking cold. Um, yeah, this is brutal. Uh, pick me up, mom. I'm scared. Jesus Christ, Flo. All right. Three, two, one, go. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Uh, Nicely done. Fifth, oh, you Whoa. He got fucked off his horse. Wow. <laughs> he's all right, he's all right. You all right? He just got fucked off his horse. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually your best time, though. 1584, you get one more try. And uh, Hans is actually up next. Kind of You're good? Okay. You did yeah. great, though. That Jesus was 1584. Thank you for that visual image, Flo. Um, Jess, you are next. Those are probably Jess rough guesses the on the time. Replace Jess in the middle of the how it is right now. All right. <laughs> Damn, I carry all that cramp on the horse, and I don't have any of it. Uh, the important thing is I had the food. Yeah, you're huddling together like penguins. Uh, that is the last person on the list, so Michael, if you want to ride, you can. So there was a playwright at St. Denis uh, at one point, Jessica, and I thought he was going to put on plays, and then he went away. I was so excited. All right. Uh, Jess, you can actually get a running sword if you want. You don't have to start right at the gate. All right. Are we in the right spot? And I will count you watch. down. Yeah, this will work. Three. Right. Two, see it all right here. One. Go. Oh, right here. Okay, uh, other other way. way. Okay. Yeah, okay. Good. Okay. Nice recovery. Hey, what did I see? All right. Uh, this is oh, Jeff. I see them over there. Yeah. I see a fucking thing with this fucking thing I got on. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I just noticed it covers your whole right. face. <laughs> 1685. I thought they were gone. I mean, hey, it protects your nose and everything. And your eyes, I know. All right. Mostly. Three, <laughs> two. Okay. One, go. Well, now Michael's sitting in front of you, so you really can't see. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter. There you go. It's okay. No problem. Hey, Michael, I'll how see you doing? With the blizzard Hi, anyway. Hey, Michael. Now you not gonna join? Huh? Hmm? Come on, come on, come on, come on. And fourteen sixty-five. That is a great time. Wow. Wow. Oh. I mean, the blizzard kind of stops that a little. Damn. What was it? It's a fourteen eighty-five. 1465. 65. Yeah. I ain't never been quick a day in my life. Liam, 
has the top time at 1342 right now. But yeah, 1465. I think that's second for the night. Yeah. Yo. Yo. No, Frankie got him beat with 1429. So that's third for the night. Oh, you're right. All right. You're right. All right, ready, Jess? Ready. Three. It's, it's a horse cow down, down. It's a horse cow. Don't set fire to me with that fucking torch, for fuck's sake. I'm not gonna, I'm sorry, I'm being careful. It's a nice and warm, but be careful, damn down. Jesus Christ. You kill me. Okay, okay. I'm enough gonna burn you. I'm going nicely done. Right. 1479. Nicely 1479. done. Xavier, I'm gonna burn him. <laughs> see. Don't play All right, this, and no, if anyone else it. wants to go, that is our last rider of the night. Like I said, it's free, oh. it's fun to learn, and yeah, it was great. just practice. Come on, this if anyone else wants to add anything, let's speak now or for a roll your piece. Uh, sure, I'll just give it a shot. Excellent, excellent. Right, go Over it. Feel free to get a running start if you hey, want, Mike. Alright. Alright. I'm guessing you're gonna tell me when. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna count you down. Just look, you're good though? You're ready to go? Good, yeah. Alright, three, uh, two, uh, one, go. Oh, oh, that's a good question. Come here. Come on. There you go. Yep. Solid corner. Solid corner. Mm. There you go. Liam, there you go. Out. There you go. 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 Pass right now, okay? Nice. <laughs> that was great. That was 1485. That's that's fucking fantastic. Yeah, that is. Very nice. All right. All right. Round two. Uh, Hans, if you want to be on deck, I saw you just showed up. Or where do you go? Oh, he's back there. All right. Whatever. Uh, Michael. Three, two, one, go. Nice. All right, 1609. All right. All right, this is this is your last one. Three, two, one, go. Oh, he's he's on it. Here you go. Come on, go, he's go, in go, the go, zone. Go. Oh, no. Come on, Mikey. Go, oh, go, no. go, go, go. Oh. So oh, you guys are in the entrance to our barrel racing right now. Yeah, Damn. Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, I would have made it. Yeah. I know, but actually, that was also 1489, so that's a great time, anyway. Wow. Nicely right. done. I'm so sorry about that. What was that? the first one? Great job, Michael. Uh, your first one was 1485, second one was 1609, third one was 1489. Uh, I'm pretty close, 1485, I was expecting to get, but I felt a little slower on yeah. the second one, so I'm not too surprised. And you ran into people in the last yeah. one, so you're good. Yeah. Alright, uh, Hans, if you're there, you can go, it's your turn, but if you're out, you're out. I am here. Yeah. Alright. Uh, Riker, you might want to move your horse, it's right in the way of the barrels. about that all right is that you dakota mm-hmm you want to sign up dakota. uh sure all right i need to look i've never done barrel racing before so it's my first time it's very simple all right everyone get out of the lot of fire or you're gonna run over by a horse oh micah you okay <laughs> there you go micah oh, we're done. <laughs> I know we're not done. We have more. Are you okay with keeping oh, yeah, being a barrel no, back I'm there? I'm, my balls off. I'm, fine. I'm sorry. <laughs> Do a little dance. Or this is what I was talking you. about, Ken. Uh, You'd be dressed for the occasion, <laughs> and uh, I am definitely not. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We kind of got screwed with placement right now, but <laughs> you can also get a run and start if you want, Hans. Uh, I I'm pie offing right now, so. <laughs> Pee off. Uh, yes, you boy, are this is good. That. This is good stuff. Uh, yeah. All right. Three. 
Look at all Two, of the people here. One, go. Hans is our world record holder on our past course, which wow. is the usual course at 12.57, so Hans Damn. is very, very good at this. Yeah, he's tearing it up. Nice. Go, go, go. Right, nice. Go, 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 go. Oh my god, that is, I think that's the time of the night. Yeah. Wow. It's 13.37, Hans just beat Liam by five seconds. Whoa. <laughs> our point oh. five seconds. Hans, you just broke a record for the night again. Congrats. Wow. Um, uh, Good run. All right. So, sorry, Lee. I'm sorry, Three, Liam. two, one, go. The people, those are people. Mm -hmm. Yes, the barrels are people. Oh. That was 1378. Oh, Jesus Christ, Hans. <laughs> I will say Hans does come to the ranch and practices on his own quite often, so I'm not really surprised. But... It shows. It what? shows. No, I do not. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Um, I don't know. All right. <laughs> and every time you've been riding a fox trotter, right? Yes. Yep. Yeah, I thought so. All right. Fox trotter, best Three. Best Two, one, go. Of course. Yeah, that's an explosive start. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. That's Hans for you. <laughs> yeah. Some coffee. Jesus wow. Christ, look at him go. Wow. Go, 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 go. Nice. Go. That was 1428. Ah, I'm going to Oh, well. Right. I, I think, I think Ooh, the last one, you just went too wide. All right, Dakota, you are next. Do you get the gist of it, Dakota? Or do you need a refresher? I think I got it. We'll see. I might just make right. a fool of myself. Uh, good luck. Uh, this is. I mean, tonight's all about practice. I know yeah. this fox trotter is insane. Uh, yeah, you can get a run and start there, Dakota. The only Hans is the P up at the start. Yeah. yeah. If you do the P up at the start. Good yeah. run. I think because the horse is engaged in the hind end of the pee off, you start with that, you get a really good acceleration boost, which is what Hans found out on his hey, own, apparently. What's a pee off? So, what, what is a, a pee off? A pee is when the horse, it's the horse when it's when the horse trots in place, basically. Ah. Uh, so, so, like, like this. It it okay. Really I thought easy. it was when, like, two people, people stand together and, and then they, like, pee and see who pees farther. Well, it looks uh, like yeah. Oh, it's different. Have a piss. Yeah, it does. And it's pretty good about holding this bladder up. Anyways, uh, Dakota, three, two, one, go. Fuck's sakes. There you go. Oh, first he's gonna... barrel. A little wide on that second one, but you're good. Yeah. All right. Oh, it's nice. about practice. You're still killing it. That was 1640. All right, Hans. How the hell did you get that explosive started out of the pee off? Because he's amazing. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have no idea. Because Hans is amazing. Okay. Yeah, I guess it is. All right. Three, two, okay. one, go. What a worry and stress treatment, but I'm okay. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. They signed on for being hit by a horse when they decided to be a barrel. It's fine. Wait, mm -hmm. no, I didn't. <laughs> mm -hmm. I said I wanted to be safe. Sounds legit. You, right. you wavered your right of safety when you became a barrel. Barrels don't have feelings. Deal with it. 1560 for the game. 1560. Oh, yeah, right. Tell us to the fucking fish barrel that you hit every day. Oh. All right. Dakota, this is your last one. I will. No, you got one oh, more. Oh, my horse more. is real antsy now. Oh, okay. <laughs> maybe that'll help. Yeah, maybe. All right, three, two, one, go. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, look at that. Nice turn. All right, that's good. You're killing it. You're yep. killing it. Come on. You got there it. You, go. Go, you go, got go, go, it. Go, go. This is great. You're doing great. 1445. That's your best. Nice. I mean, I'll take it. 
Yeah, that's not bad. That's all right. So first of the night is Hans, obviously. Yep. With what is it? Thirteen fifty-seven. Uh, I got a thirteen thirty-one. Liam McCarthy. Oh, is that what I'm? Is that what I said? I wrote down thirteen fifty-seven. Maybe I just wrote down wrong. Was it thirteen thirty-one? Okay. Yeah, thirty-one. I, I think. Thirty-seven. Maybe. Oh, I think I put. Oh yeah. Yep. Thirteen thirty-seven. There, okay. there you go. There you oh, go. Yeah, because Liam was second. That's what it was. Hans is first, thirteen thirty-seven. Liam's second at thirteen forty-two, and then Hans is also third at thirteen seventy-eight. But I guess the next person closest uh. is uh frankie at 1427 i think that's the Ooh. next person there we go 14. Yeah. Good runs, everyone. yep 1429 yeah, I mean, we are 1429 yep. oh no frankie's second was 1429 and first one was 1427 okay yeah, yeah i missed that one wants to go, it is... you got it i missed that one <laughs> if, anyone, if anyone else wants oh, to no, go I'm gonna do it. Hang on. all right flo i'm ready oh you're just gonna run would it be good to, I mean, um, I'm good. I'm good. You Yeah, you can sign up, Riker. Go get your horse. She's so fast. She's got it, yeah. Is she, is she, oh, she's really doing it. Yep, yep. I, I'm sorry. I'm, there she goes. Finish. I'm sorry. <laughs> Where's the watch on that one? Uh, okay, you know what? You want me to time you fine. All right, all right. You got it. You got it. Uh, all right. The, what's the best barrel? Three, two, one, go. Go, Flo. You can make it. Uh, where did Will go? Are you not gonna are you not gonna be a barrel anymore? Uh where Riker wanted to sign up. We have one more unless someone else wanted to go. <laughs> that is, so is I, that is a thick I will tell you the horse in a second. Flo, that is the worst time we've ever had at twenty seven and fifty six. Congratulations. <laughs> Nicely you are, done. You are the worst. Nicely done. Thank you. All right, something. so Riker, the course is you're gonna go, you're gonna start right back here. Okay. And then I start the time once you cross the gate threshold. You're gonna go uh, counterclock, yeah, counter, no, yeah, counterclockwise around Will. And then you're gonna go counterclockwise. And then you're gonna go counterclockwise around Jess back down the rock. So Actually, no. I go counterclockwise yeah, yeah. like this. A uh, clockwise. Sorry, I was fucking oh. up my clock directions. You're gonna go clockwise around. Right. It is cold. Yeah, clockwise. clockwise yeah, that way. Right and then counterclockwise around the other two. Oh, sorry. Where's the other tree that I go counterclockwise around? The, the this tree right here behind the bushes. Yes. Get in here for a second. Counterclockwise. Counterclockwise around. Uh, Wash up for a second. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. You get to. I, I do have almost everything down. I, I kind of missed flows. I think it was 2847. But uh, other than that, I think I got pretty much everything else. Yes, sir. I missed uh, whoever the first person was. I missed them. But uh, right, everybody else, too, we're people. good. Give me one I, I thought that was going to happen. Okay. All right. Just let me know when you're ready. Okay. I'm ready. All right. On go. Three, two, one. One, go. Great start. There you go. Solid. Oh, you forgot the right okay. directions for a second. There you go. Yo, yo. Go, 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 go. Nice. Go, go, go. All right, 1507. Great first time. Great first time. You get two more tries. Okay. Oh, 
That was a great start, though. You did mm -hmm. push it at the beginning, so that helped you. Yeah, he blew right, right out it. Three, two, one, go. There you go. Nice. Man, the horse hauls. All right, 15 13. 15 13. 15 13. All right, I think your problem is on the hill, you go a little bit too wide and you lose some of your momentum. Okay. So try to tighten it up, I think, on that last barrel. And I think you'll keep your speed better. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh. You, oh. you can you, you can restart. Yeah, restart. Okay. No, you, you can restart. Don't worry. As long as you slip there. Yeah, you did slip across that. That means I see that side. Yeah. Right. Three, two, one, go. Wow. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank right. you. Here you go. Tight, tight, tight. Nice, oh, nice. Go. Uh, go, 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 go. Nice. Well done. 1489. 1489. That is your best. Fantastic for your first show record. Yeah, well done. Well done. All right. Flo, what did I tell you your time was? It was like 27 something. 2849. 2829. There you go. All right. I mean, that's everyone, unless someone else wants to go again. But anyone else want to volunteer mean, for the races? Do, uh, do you want to see if a, a pee off, a, a pee off while I'm cantering, <laughs> would be any better? Yeah, try it. Why not? All right. All right, Hans, let's try one more time. Barrels, thank you for your patience. Y'all are doing great. I owe you all a drink. Just trying it the pee off of the canter, which is actually technically, I guess, what is that? It's like a canter pirouette, but you're not pirouetting, so it's just yeah. whatever. All right, Hans, you ready? Yep, I am ready. All right, are you Kill pirouetting it, right now? Are you Kill it, Hans. Okay, in my eyes are just standing there, but all right, three, two, one, go. And he's off. Wow, damn, yeah, so, well, it looks like he's jumping around. Not for me, I know. Oh, ah. a little wide there. But man, he makes up for it in the speed. Uh, he does. It's nice. All right, that was 1436. I think it's just because you went wide on that second one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> but that was you an wanna, explosive you try start. Get... That was an explosive start. Yeah, I'll try. <laughs> I think it's just I don't get t enough time to get my bearings. Yeah, it is all about speed, so. Yeah, hang on. All right, three, two, one, go. Hello, hello. Damn. Yep, it's crazy. Oh, nope, 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 nope. <laughs> yep, yep. Too wide. Yeah. Yeah, it's getting slippery on that hill. I bet. Yeah, fourteen ninety. Yeah, you just went too wide on that second turn. Yep. Yeah, it's a. It's, yeah. <laughs> The hell of the takeoff. <laughs> yeah. Anyone else want to try their hand of air racing? It is not hard. Let's just crawl over. Yep. That's it. That's the way to go. If no one else wants to go, that'll be it. Wow. Well, it was great. Yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, Micah. Micah, you can come in. Be great. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, William, is that you? Yeah, that's 
William. William. What I tell you about the snow, huh? Everyone made fun of me. What I tell you? What I tell? <laughs> what did I tell you? Yeah. Yeah. And what did he tell Jezebel, you, William? And you tell Jezebel. Fuck. Fuck you. Cause I was right. Who's oh, I the can't see fuck you. is Jezebel? Wait, where? Well, there we have it. Barrel racing. That's pretty cool. The environment is amazing. It really is. I mean, I am I'm legitimately feeling very chilly watching this. You got him. Yep. Whose torch did I borrow? I got given this because I was freezing my balls off with my lamp. Pitchfork. Good lord, it's cold. Nice Hi. job. Jump Man. Dogs. Did a great job with that horse. <laughs> yeah, he knows how to ride a horse, that's for sure. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Beautiful horse. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. This horse actually, funnily enough, is named after my mother. Oh, yeah? Oh, well, let's see. Mm hmm. What's the what's and the horse's name? The horse's name is Trouder. And the other fox trout I have his name is Strauss, which is my father's Who's name. Torch Strauss. Which I actually did the other barrel race Someone with. Give me a torch for okay, okay. Yeah, this is the first one I've caught and uh man, it is uh, it's something to see. It is definitely a good time. Uh, usually it happens over there, but someone sort of glued all the barrels to the floor by the looks of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's okay. You guys did great. That, that was a <laughs> that was a great show uh, from everybody. Uh, I'm glad you uh, enjoyed yourself. Mm -hmm. You're the uh, sponsor for the yeah? That's correct. Yeah, I'm uh, uh, out here. Well, I'm supposed to be covering uh, some other sports, but this is perfect. This this works out great. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, it was uh, it was. I mean, uh, the weather is uh, is cold, but uh, you gotta expect <laughs> that this time of year. Yep. Well, I'm glad you managed to get your you know your feet wet with the stuff. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, this is perfect. This is uh, exactly what I'm looking for. I'll uh, send this back to the home office, and uh, they'll they'll be they'll eat this up. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go join my compatriots. So yeah. What was your name again? Uh, Robert. Robert Stockton. Robert. Nice yeah. to meet you. I'm Hans. Hans. It's a, a pleasure to meet you, and uh, great job again with the horse. Look forward to seeing more of you in the future. Likewise. Be gods, it's cold. All right. Y'all folks be safe. I'm right up north. Yep. Uh oh, there he is! Shit, almost panicked there. I know. Let's get out of here. Find some place warm. Great job as a barrel. Thank you. Very convincing. Sorry. Oop. Excuse me. Let me get out of the way here. Hey, what's up? How are you doing? Back to the bar. Good. How are you? Excellent. Excellent. This is uh, just the kind of thing you were telling me. And uh, perfect. Right. Perfect stuff for the, the send back east. Yeah, you like it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. A great group of folks here, too. I don't even know if I've got that much. Power in Blizzardy, but. Well, you know, it's that time of year. All right. Ready? 
I'm happy, man. I'm happy. I hope you guys get stuff again. When you, if you get something that you know, gets published, please send it to me. I'd love to read it. Yeah, you bet. Yeah, no problem. I'm uh, looking forward to it. It, uh, Like I said, this is uh, great stuff. Very inspirational. Awesome. Well, thank you very much for coming out. We really appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for uh, hosting it. It was, uh, it was a pleasure coming back out here again and uh, seeing the place, all the people and everything. It's great. Yeah, a little more lively, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll be swinging through this area because uh, I got to, you know, I got to go uh, pretty much back and forth. So right. this is a good little stop, and it's always a pleasure uh, seeing you guys out here. Yeah, just make sure when you ride it, you ride Tyler Rohn ran this whole thing. It's all him, so. Okay, okay. Yeah, excellent, Great excellent. Architect. Thanks again, Joe. I really appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. It's a pleasure. Hey, what's up? Good to see you, Abe Barrows. Appreciate you being here. And I uh, hope you're enjoying the stream. I got, oh man, I got some great shots. Uh, I got to a really good shot of uh, Riker in the gates. And I don't know how it turned out, but uh, it looked like it was a good, going to be a good shot. Uh, it's always hard to tell with the, the wind and all the other effects and stuff. But uh, man... Uh, this was really cool to see, especially with all the people here and, uh, the weather coming in. Uh, this is, uh, cold as hell. Uh, wait, let's see. Oh, you know what? This is what I need to do. Oh, come on. Work with me. If I can. Hey, uh, excuse me there, uh, Joe. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, yeah uh, do you mind if I uh, uh, use uh, uh, one of the stables over there to uh, get changed? I, I, I got clothes on me. Oh, I uh, just, uh, just need a spot. Nice to meet you, friend. Oh, you good to what? meet you. If you want, you can use one of the cabins over here. That way you're not in the freezing cold. Oh, that's okay. I got all the stuff on the horse, and uh, it's not a problem. Oh, no, that's fine. And you, yeah, you can pick any stable. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I appreciate it. Uh, once again, uh, uh, thanks again, man. Uh, 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 the uh, the hospitality out here is uh, A number one. Yeah, we try. Excellent. <sighs> All right. Have a good night, everybody. There we go. And, and we get to break out the... Uh, the winter clothes I put this together a couple of days ago and I've been kind of dying for this to happen so this will work uh, can't close the gate oh well close enough whoops there it is now <laughs> the horse is probably going to kick the shit out of me here so, wait, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, it's probably trying to put, why is it trying to put it away? Okay, wait. Horse is already out. Okay, don't understand that. 
see if we can see if we can get this to work. Uh, I was having problems with the menus before, wasn't I? Uh, I don't want to do that. All right, you know what? Not gonna work. Make the best of this and uh, just head on out at this point. Damn. Definitely tweaking on the horse. Um. Hmm. Well, this will have to do. We're just going to get stuck with the menu up. I forget what I used before to break it. Out. Oh, let's do Let's do this. There's a door over here. Yeah, there we go. This might do it. Nope. Damn. Okay. the follow appreciate it and uh welcome to the stream and uh, uh let's see how am i gonna fix that can i use this that's uh, gonna stay up well let's try this now that i'm away from there okay now it's just completely locked up do it ah uh, good idea venture chair well I'm gonna find too many of those right here but yeah let's try that uh if works and worse I can hmm, do the awkward go over put the horse away put it back pull it back out again that did it last time I think it did. Uh huh. We just went bye bye. Yeah, we tried that. Tried the escape backspace. Yeah, but uh, there's some kind of a some kind of an error that was floating through there, and uh, caused irreparable craziness. We'll get it fired back up again, and uh, pretend like that didn't happen. Thanks again for the follow, and uh, appreciate you guys uh, swinging on by the uh, the stream as uh, we get to dime novel. Ooh, okay. Oh boy, that was that looks like that was that wasn't just me. Yeah. Okay. We all we all kind of took a nap. Let's uh let's swap on over to Shoot. There it is. Yeah. Looks like the server decided to take a little bit of a nap. But uh fear not it looks like we're in pretty good shape and uh, that'll also give us the opportunity to kind of fix a couple other things yes <laughs> you're right Del. uh crashing is definitely going to fix uh the problem that i was having excellent do you think uh, okay now i'm just going to guess that it's just straight up coincidence that uh that i happen to be heading over to that spot with a, a clearly a broken menu in a, uh, a ham-handed hack that I think I had kind of found before. I don't think I crashed the server, did I? <laughs> it's like it's like the ultimate in uh, in uh, a self 
uh, narcissism. It was me. I did it. <laughs> uh, like, okay, so that was pretty cool. I was very happy with that. Uh, that was a lot of fun. And uh, really good to see all, everybody uh, hanging out there um, and uh, uh, being real cool about it. I was hoping I wasn't being too loud because I, I totally forgot that uh, I had my uh, my voice volume and uh, it was on medium, which should be kind of conversational, but like they were talking about the bar there before, um, that uh, they like people to be whispering, which I can kind of understand that. Um, that, uh, that totally makes sense that, uh, you don't want to, you know, somebody shouting all the time, like, like I was doing, but, uh, well, it is what it is. Um, in the meantime, uh, while we're waiting here, I am going to take a quick break because, uh, yeah, my water is almost empty and, uh, wow, it's, man, I have just been sucking down the water. Uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna take a, take a few minutes here, and then, uh, we'll come back with, uh, more H.C. Dime Novel, uh, issue number four. And, uh, thanks again, everybody, for joining me. I uh, appreciate you guys hanging out and, uh, chatting along. And also, uh, it's always great to, uh, have everybody that joins me on the VOD. Man, I'll tell you what, uh, the VOD views are, uh, very encouraging. I love to see it, and I'm glad you guys are, uh, having fun with this stuff. And like I said, if anything, I'm here to give you another viewpoint. So, you know, don't, like I said, don't forget, uh, where did, did I have it? Yeah, here we go. Uh -oh, make sure I copy it correctly. Check that out. Right there. Uh, that's all, everybody that's currently streaming. And, uh, it's a, a way for you to kind of, uh, see all of the other, uh, things that are going on and uh in that kind of a situation like i'll bet I'll, and this is what i always love doing is uh like a uh um where uh, where uh, there's a couple of uh the folks that are currently streaming yeah i think i'm pretty sure uh yeah i think uh, most of these people were at least out there were part of it and uh yeah definitely check it out uh there's some uh some great streamers uh covering the stuff right now and like i said if anything i wanted to be like a, another set of eyes uh and i thought i got a, a pretty good location for it and uh some decent screenshots so uh that'll be a lot of fun to uh, uh see more of that as uh we go along but in the meantime i'm going to take a quick five minutes and then uh we'll be right back with more hc dime novel number four the uh, story of uh, Robert Stockton and uh, this particular one subtitled The Time.
All right. And uh, we're back. I got to get my water. And uh, I'm ready to continue on. We're uh, loaded in. And uh, just about ready here. Let's, uh, let's throw it over to this. And uh, we get the opportunity once again to do one of my favorite things of all time. Just drop right in. Plump. Hello. Oh. Okay. Hello again. Hello. That's a fine cup. Okay. Hey. Sorry, what I missed? It would be fair to Palomitas. What I miss? What I found? Uh. Oh. I keep asking him, and he's all, it's medicinal, I don't got none regular. I'm like, huh, come on, buddy. I know he's got something. You folks have a good day. You too. Yeah, you showed up. Do, do, do. I didn't want to wander off into. Let me uh, let me make sure. Do, 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 do. Yeah. That's our path. Um, is it? Yeah, I think it is. Let's do that. Let's make all that happen. Uh, once again, thanks for joining me here on uh, the uh, Adamus Clue channel. As uh, we do the uh, HC Media, or uh, I'm sorry, HC Dime Novel. It's a. There we go. Get the title correct, which we have now. Uh, appreciate you guys swinging on by. Don't forget to, you can, uh, you'll be able to check out the VODs for this uh, here on uh, the uh, Twitch channel and also over on the YouTube channel as well. Um, while we're uh, trotting away here, let's, um, okay, there we go. That's the, uh, the new YouTube archive. Uh, from there, you can also find the Cap Atomos archive, which is last year's, um, stuff that we did. So, uh, there you'll find the story of George Anderson, uh, also, uh, an HC Dime novel. Uh, takes place over on the Wild RP server, and uh, I think there's like one or two of uh, George here. And uh, it turned out that, yeah, Wild was a, a little better place for George uh, to get going. And uh, just like uh, this is uh, a little bit uh, a little bit better place, I think, for uh, Robert to get going. Or at least he's gotten going. And uh, that's that's all that counts right now. Uh, we're moving forward and uh, getting uh, getting some story done. 
Uh, right now, though, I wanted to go run over here. And so we just had server restart. And uh, hit up the bait and tackle shop. Uh, now, remember, uh, one of the things that we picked up there in uh, as we came in, uh, <laughs> I ran into uh, the cops there and uh, pulled the whole, like, hands up and, uh, yeah, give them all the stuff. I was having some... I don't know what the mic issue was. It was uh, really, really kind of frustrating. Um, but I, I think it stems from something that happened earlier in the stream. And, uh, yeah, I, I think I have to restart the software in order to uh, modify it. But uh, we've got it working. We're back on uh, and people can hear us. So uh, that was uh, that was good. It was a lot of fun. I, uh, I, I definitely didn't catch everybody. So, yeah, I'll be... <laughs> I'll be hitting up the VOD uh, to make sure to uh, update uh, my new knowledge and notes because, uh, yeah, Robert would be SOL if uh, if I were him. Uh, so lucky for him, he's him and not me. But uh, yeah, we'll get to we'll get all the info and everything else that we need. Uh, pull that all up. But uh, yeah, it was good. We got to we got the races and everything. I know, since the server's restarting now, this is kind of a weird sort of like, oh, and then it didn't snow. Um, but uh, it was great. This, this is perfectly the way to uh, to kind of run with, uh, run with an ill situation. And uh, just move on. Part of what I love about doing this. And stuff like this. Oh, good. Like I said, it's just one of the things that I just have a lot of fun with that, especially uh, switching up the camera and uh, doing all of the stuff with it. And uh, I found some really good music uh, to, uh, to work with this. <clears throat> okay. Excellent. But is it me or is it like really warm in the room suddenly? <laughs> I love how the environment just, uh, man, everything about it, like they've done a, such a good job with the foley, uh, the uh, the sound effects. Like that winter, that wind is, I'll, I'll tell you, from personal experience, that is dead accurate. That horrible sound and watching everybody recoil as they get pelted in the face with 
ice. For those of you that haven't experienced it, mm -hmm. it's very accurate. Uh, much like uh, how this is, uh, is, is a little too warm. There we go. Uh, let's see. Well, we can bounce on over to here real quick and uh, pick up our cart. Uh, let's come in this way. And that's it. I had one specifically for this this particular run. Here it is. It's called Guns and Meadows. Why not? There it is. There we go. Enjoy. So good man uh, you know I, again i've done that run that uh from uh the shack there uh out to uh here oops that's uh 
take care of this problem. I've done that run uh, so many times, and uh, it it never has looked like that. Uh, again, uh, <laughs> it's so I, I love the uh, the fact that in this stream we have the the just horrible snowstorm going on, and then uh, just through total fate uh, we got uh, this. Uh, it's just a, a great, great thing. Hello. Move along. I'm going. You got it. The, uh, the old get to the other side right there. You're good. You're all clear. You got it. There you go. Perfect. Good enough. Well done. Sort of. Did you just see that, chat? Did that actually just happen? Hmm. I don't know. Probably not. Get out of your way. All set. figure something out um i just want to get all the base prices for all the uh, this is what i got i want yeah well 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 we're there he is what's up buddy? hey how's it going i was just uh just about to sit down here a second and uh write this up all right uh do you need anything uh, I think I'm good. I got to uh, uh, get this bottle left over, and uh, I'm, I'm just gonna uh, finish this up from uh, earlier, and then uh, I'll uh, I'll probably uh, maybe need something to eat a little bit later. But right, uh, well, uh, just call me ever. Yep. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. Of I didn't want to interrupt you guys. So uh, yeah, go about oh. your business. Do your thing. I got to do mine. Right. Okay. Figured there'd be some people here, but it looks like they're doing a meeting thing, so. Uh, take a moment. Uh, let's see, what did we get? We got to. Uh, I, I didn't get any last names, so that was uh, kind of a fail on my part. Um, but uh, I think we'd agreed that uh, Frankie had third. 
uh, with 14.29. Hans just killed it. He was just like, he was uh, just a machine. He got to first and technically... Well, he got first with uh, 13.37. Damn. And then, uh, I forget who is second. Oh, I think it was, uh, Liam? Yeah, yeah, Liam. 13.42. But I don't know. I, I have to admit, uh, Flo with the uh, 28 49 or 47 I don't know which one but she was killing it well I am just pounding away on whatever this is I'm drinking Can you grab something? Uh, let me get a let's see was there a better one there probably was a better one let's see uh oh, oh this is no, this is way more than I wanted. Um, okay, I may need to, uh, to jump out of it real quick, but if we can get away with this. Yep, perfect. So yeah, that was uh that was good. And then um we have we had two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten contestants, I think. Three, six, nine, ten. Yep. Ten that I saw. Now there might have been somebody at the very beginning that I missed. But uh I still still have to uh double check the name on uh, the horse i know that's the uh the other one that apparently uh uh hans had uh, won the other barrel race uh his name was named after his father strauss and uh yeah i, I missed the uh the other one was named after his mom uh which is a uh, very cool a nice uh nice way to go about it Mm, let's see. I picked a pretty good spot here. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I wanted. An okay shot. Um, oh. I need to check a couple of things here too while we're sitting still for a sec. Okay, good. That's everything that I got. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, we definitely need to dump. We got two bucks. So, if I get anything, I'm going to have to run to the bank here real quick. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, I figured I'd, I'd have to sit down and uh, do this part. Write it up. I'll say, I'm pretty sure that I saw uh, the, uh, the other Liam. Uh, hanging out there. Uh, which he, he had asked me to look into the newspaper thing because he had something going on here in town. So I'll uh, at least be able to give him the uh, the top three, and uh, I guess publish the rest later. If uh, they don't end up on uh, the Discordian newspaper. Everybody loves the Discordian newspaper.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure they were working up menu items and uh, some other stuff. They got some great stuff going on in uh, here and uh, over in uh, in Valentine. Uh, let's see, uh, what was it called again? Cats. Oh. That's me. There it is. Uh, oh, it disappeared. Yeah, there used to be a, a thing marking it. Huh. That's okay. Oh, These things come and How go. Uh, five dollars. You can give it to you can give it to Mr. Green over here. It's all right. You're still learning. Oh wait, here. It's raining again. Okay. Uh, no. You know, you're you're okay, right. Listen. I probably shouldn't because you pushed me off a roof. See, I probably shouldn't tip him because he did push me off a roof earlier. You did too. Are you lying to your? <laughs> pull our coat out of, <clears throat> pull our coat out of our bag and uh grab some cash we can uh buy some dinner <laughs> The foul night. All night in Blackwater. Oh, good lord, what am I doing? <laughs> Hello, sir. Howdy. Also take Yeah, yeah. That's happened more than once. How did you drop? Oh, your ammo. Hmm. Why are you being like this? We're good. Good. There's no point making any more of this. You got room for anything? Yeah. Hop down here real quick. And roll one up. Oh, you got to fight with your hat on? Oh wow, hey Nora, um, hi, hi Nora, nothing going on here, nothing, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, okay. two concerning go. adults having a little bit of rough housing, it's not even a dispute, it's just a little friendly battle, wait, Nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah, hey, Nora. One of them is. I don't think Nora appreciates that. The humor has drained out of it. Well, doesn't mean we won't uh, do this. There we go. Mm. 
Jeez. You just get into there, champ. I don't think there was a good notebook one. Take a look. Oh, it's a desk writing. Let's try that. There we go. Excellent. That works good. What's up, Bionic Arm? I'm bored, Coley. You done with work for the week? Damn. This would, uh... This is... Cuttings on this would stay like they are supposed to. settings. Yeah, whatever. We'll figure it out. A couple of days covering maybe Monday night. Uh, but yeah, dude, relax. And uh, thanks for stopping by, man. I'll uh, I'll uh, keep that in mind. Give you some good relaxing, hopefully, situations to go in. Uh, been uh, going now for a little over five hours and uh you got a couple of uh, good things in in the vod so it'll give you something to watch um solid snowball or solid snow situation of course it'll probably make you laugh because everybody's sitting around shivering and it's probably just like a summer day to you but you can't even tell the truth oop shit sorry chugging down the water tonight but uh yeah um i uh i didn't really have any plans and uh we ran into a uh, um, couple of things uh we met a few folks and uh still meeting people of course oh well drunkard uh 
staggering around the bar. Um, but yeah, we met a few folks. Uh, we got to we got questioned by the police, uh, <laughs> and uh, for some reason the mic wasn't working, so that was an even more weirdly awkward situation. Uh, we're hanging out now in a town called Blackwater at uh, the uh, uh, saloon here. Uh, I believe it's called Birdies. And uh, things are starting to pick up. Just throttle this down here, make sure I'm volumed oh, up. Did I? Uh, there we go. Hey, Dell, what can I do? I don't think for? I did. So, um, so yeah, uh, let's see. Uh, there's a couple of people here. And, uh, yeah, the, we, uh, we went out and covered, uh, horse races. And so what I'm doing here is, uh, I'm writing it up. As you can see. What? Now, friend? Uh, there we go. I guess I'm writing. I'm doing something to the table. I think I'm etching my name on it. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to get something to eat here in a minute. And, uh, I was kind of waiting for daybreak. Which, uh, looks like it's pretty close. And then, uh, we're gonna head on out. Um. To, uh, the other side of the map. But, uh, looks like there's quite a bit going on here. So maybe we'll hang out here for a little while. Get the, the feeling for the bar crowd. All right. What do you mean? Friday night, so pretty busy. We've uh, run into a couple of crashes and uh, some other funky things, like whatever the hell that is going on outside. Um, but for the most part, things have been going pretty well. There's uh, currently 83 people on the server. And, uh, okay. boy, the, uh, also, usually when you the, uh, sale, like, horse races um, were, like uh, five or whatever, pretty cool. There's a lot of people there. Lamans, so like the, the Not that there isn't here. I, I believe I can do that, no problem. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people. Um, yes. um very interesting. The, uh, the big talk, uh... Most of the evening has been about uh, the Ballers gang, who is apparently terrorizing everyone. Uh, generally, they kidnap. Apparently, they kidnap people, and then uh, it's a ten thousand dollar bounty or a ten thousand dollar for working here ransom for uh, for them. So, yeah, that's not going to happen with uh, with Robert. So. We'll have to figure out what's going on from there, because uh, I'm kind of keeping him, you know, he's the observer. He's moving in and out of uh, the locations. And uh, doesn't really <laughs> doesn't really have anybody that... Uh, I'm pretty sure I don't know anybody that has 10k. Oh, really? Okay. Everything has a price. You just let me know, and I can give... And this is... I can tell you a fair price to sell it. But uh, then I'm not, uh, I'm not the kind of uh, target that I think they're looking for. They basically so you were like earlier today like apparently kidnapped the, the uh, well, sorry, quote unquote father of the town, mm -hmm. um, and uh, he was a 10k bounty, to to and apparently was over in the uh, the hospital tent uh, just before I went out to uh, okay. just before I went out. Ah, damn it! It's snowing again. Uh, but okay. like venison, if you want venison, uh, plain venison well, maybe you is $6. Like I said, I'm going to get the chance, uh, like finally, to get my snow outfit William, where do we keep out. The logs that kind of fire? stuff is uh, $6. If it's got any, uh, like oregano, thyme, or mint, $7. Um, uh, okay. Frog legs is 4 ish four or $5. Uh, and... Um, yeah, if, if someone just wants like a light snack, you can even... If, yeah, you know, so here it goes. It's starting to snow again. Dollars, you know, uh, game bird. Uh, and like plump, plump, 
turkey leg and uh, some game meat and stuff. Four, four-ish dollars here. And then anytime it's got a herb or a spice, just add a dollar to it. <laughs> it's gonna take a little getting used to uh, outside of the 50 and 30. I think we've concluded our writing for the time being. So let's do this. Uh, where was it? Top? Where's this one? I think I just warped over to here. Yep. Okay, that probably looked weird. Whatever. Oh, that's what it was. Because the chair was selected. Yeah. Okay, that's what it was. Oh, okay, that's where that is. I'm still getting used to it. There's so, as you can see here, these are all the different emotes that you can do while sitting in the chair. And basically what they've done is that they've unlocked all of the... Uh, there we go. That's the one I was looking for. They've unlocked all of the um, emotes that... Uh, or the actions, emotes, whatever you want to call this. The scenes that uh, all of the um, NPCs do. And they give us the opportunity to use them. Now, basically, my character is locked right now. Uh, I can pop it out of this, um, but uh, you get the idea. You can, outside, the, the well, you can do this kind of thing. Snow. Yes, I went and got prepared. But in the meantime, we need to make sure that place is safe so people don't slip and crack their heads up. All right? so respect perfection. Just make sure. Just make sure it's a little bit clear. Thank you, Mister. Enjoy, Mister. Uh, Oh god. I'm actually I'm actually fine. I, I I'm not that hungry honestly. I, I just enjoy supporting the place. Right. Much appreciated. Of course. And you're breaking. Oh, am I? I... Great. Excellent. Get to take the uh, the card out on uh, on the snow. Okay. This is pretty much cleared out. Finish our writing. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Is that someone's horse here? No one claiming it? All right. It doesn't have a saddle or anything. No. I think it's just one. Of, I think it's just one of them that wandered into town. What? Yeah, I'm working hey. on it. Uh, thanks again. Thanks again for the yeah. use of the table. Uh, that was super helpful and uh, obviously uh, uh, much easier than trying to write it to someplace else. So uh, oh, yeah, I appreciate it. Uh, here. Take that and uh, put it towards the till. All right. Well, well appreciated. Mm -hmm. uh, if you ever need anything, you see me around, you know. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. No problem. Like I said, thanks again. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll see you in the future. All right. You have a good night. You too. You too. I 
$100 tip. Not bad. The home office is picking it all up. We don't care. I think we tipped the other bar 200 bucks. So. Alright, so uh, the outfit is on the horse. How's it going? Good, good. It's going fine. Yeah, 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 doing great. Give you a minute there. I'll uh, grab my horse out of the stable. Thank you. Have we met before, sir? Uh, yeah, yeah. I think uh, I think uh, we met over here yesterday. I was like right over here. Uh, uh name's Robert. Robert Stockton. The, no. uh, I don't think we met uh, no. I don't think we met here yesterday. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Well, then I, I probably not. Or yeah, maybe it was the day before. Else. I don't know. I, I get so many things mixed up. I'm running all over the place. Uh, I'm supposed to be covering the, the sports out here. So, you know, racing from town to town. Uh, uh, meeting all kinds of people. Really, really? Mm -hmm. uh, have you seen the barrel races? Yeah, oh, it was excellent. I was uh, just out there, and uh, man, it was a lot of fun. It got cold. Oh, good day, it got cold. But uh, the races were great. Do you take part in any of your refreshments? Uh, no, I haven't uh, haven't really uh, gotten much. I see, I see. Yo, I was uh, planning on heading over uh, uh, probably the other side of uh, uh, town because I get to uh, swing by uh, my place over at uh, Saint Denis. They get me on a, in the hotel there and uh, grab a few things. And then, uh, see, see. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, I had heard this uh, this rumor that uh, uh, there's uh, some kind of a, a a thing that they've got uh, squirrels boxing uh, up in uh, Van Horn, and I got to chase that down. Squirrels boxing. Yeah, like little squirrels with uh with boxing gloves. I, I well at least that's what the guy told me. Now he he had been drinking, so this may be a dead end, but you, you gotta follow the lead, you know. I think I saw a squirrel with a with a revolver. With a revolver? Okay, okay. On, uh, well, like a top the top of a Hagen Mountain. Hagen Mountain. Okay, okay. Hmm. Okay. Well that might be a I mean, Mount Hagen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me drop that, drop that down. And uh, so you, you see, it was a squirrel, and he had a revolver. Oh wait, it wasn't Mount Hagen. It was. Uh... Oh, Mount Sean. Sean, Mount Sean. Okay, okay. Yeah, I, I got that. I'll jot that down. So it was a uh, okay. A squirrel with a revolver. That that sounds like uh, it sounds like exactly the uh, the kind of thing that I need to look into because uh, yeah, this boxing thing would be huge if uh, huge for the publication. You know, if uh, we could get it uh, sent out east and uh, they get it published, that's that's great. This is a great lead. I appreciate it. What, what, what I, I paper are name. you writing for? Uh, I, 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 uh, I I'm working for a, a, a dime novel. Uh, they're trying to basically up their readership. And uh, do you like these uh, mini magazines? Uh, I guess oh. I, I call them uh, tabloids or something like that. Oh, you know, sounds excellent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, well, you know, it uh, it sounds like it, but uh, you know, they sent me out here to uh, cover a baseball team, and uh, nobody knows what baseball is. So, you know, uh, their uh, their leads are uh, questionable at best. Yeah, I haven't heard of it, but I've only been okay. in this country a few months. Yeah, yeah, well, that's a, yeah, quite a few folks I've run into, uh, fairly new to the area. So, yeah, uh, you know, the leads are, uh, uh, you know, uh, sometimes uh, dead ends. But, uh, uh, oh, oh, my name is uh, Axel, by the way. What's, what's your Axel. name? Axel, Axel, excellent. I, I like it. Uh, yeah, uh, once again, uh, uh, Robert Stockton is the name. Right, 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 you told me. Yeah, yeah. 
and uh you hear it a couple of times you know first time you meet someone yeah well that's what yeah i always try to uh you know repeat it uh, you say hello and then uh, you give them your name and then you repeat it again and uh that that seems to help but uh axel uh, Stockton. where uh where are you from yeah, i'm from sweden sweden excellent so this is like uh, this is like summer for you uh not really you know we have, uh... <laughs> I'm kidding. Climate I'm kidding. is pretty similar to uh, Hansburg. What the hell? What the hell was that? What the fuck? Oh, look out! Good God! What the fuck was that? Oh, goddamn world rock! There is some gang activity activity around. Yeah, uh, you folks hear that? Yeah, uh, the whole yeah. the whole goddamn barn was shaking. What the hell was that? I guess it was an explosion. Shit. Yeah, <laughs> it Someone definitely was that. Office. There's literally a crater in the in the office. There's a crater in the office from bomb. Well, I'm not running over oh, to that. Liam's gonna be so pissed. Liam, I'm so sorry. Your office has been exploded. Oh. My, my greatest condolences to you. Yeah, no kidding. Sorry for your loss. But is, until it is done? They're uh, doing terror acts against journalists. Well, well that, uh, well, no, that checks out. Still be on fire. Uh, the anarchists have been real bad out east, so it doesn't surprise me. Hopefully Just Liam's okay. Tonary, uh, Mm -hmm. He runs his uh, newspaper from inside dive. here. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, that makes sense. Seems like the kind of thing they'd go after. Free speech and all. Who threw the di dynamite? What dynamite? I want a simple answer. Who threw the dynamite? I, there was a boom in the telegram office. Yes, there was. Who threw the fucking dynamite? We did, we did see two folk running away from the sheriff's office. The One of them shouted, Long man scattered and ran off. That was it. Fucking a. Okay. So oh, they, they could have escaped said, out the back. They said something scatter. No. Yeah, they were they were on. <sighs> God damn it. Emma Rose said that she heard somebody scream fire in the hole. She ran out and she heard an explosion. She's coming right now. She can. Okay, so where, where's our Emma Rose? Come on. I think, I, I think the best course of action is to just basically walk away. Yo. Liam, if you need any, if you need the boiler or anything repaired, don't hesitate to contact me. I might be able to get you fixed up. I think uh, all being collected in one place is probably a bad idea. Yeah, <sighs> walking towards the explosion is probably a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, you know, it's just kind of a natural thing to do, I guess. Yeah. Well, uh, you're going to San Denis, right? Uh, yeah, I was heading out over there. Uh, I, I need to uh, grab some things off my horse, and then uh, I've got. Uh, uh, I bought a buggy, one of the small buggies. I'll tell you what, that is a, a great way to travel. Yeah, they're very quick. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Very, very quick. It's great. Perfect for uh, what I need to do, which is uh, get from place to place real quick. That's right. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. But I, I need to head over to the uh, saloon. But, okay, uh, Axel. Well, pleasure to meet you, man. Yeah, it was a pleasure meeting you, and uh, look forward to seeing you around. Have a good day. Yeah, have a good day, man. Safe travels. You too. Safe travels. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> They're going after the journalist, everybody. Got him, anarchist. All right, let's hope this doesn't freak out. Hmm. That'd be a good way to go. Uh, I need these horse because uh, it seems yeah. like there are multiple of them. Yeah, I'm uh, trying to get to get my note, but uh, making sure that everybody gets theirs cleared first. Ah. Uh. 
Yeah, I think this one might be a demon horse. I might just try to get it out of the way this Turkoman. Okay, okay. Okay, I guess I have to get off the Turkoman. Hmm. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, I'm not really sure which uh, which horse you're looking at. Yeah, I know this is how mules are made, but mm -hmm. um. <clears throat> That one's a mystical one. Yeah. From beyond. Yeah. It fits with the weather. Uh, hang on, I'll go find Liam McCarthy. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. I think I can actually get... You know what? Uh, yeah, I got it. It's a food, food thing. Yeah, see, he doesn't, uh, he probably doesn't see it. Wow, that dynamite is serious. I'm like, it kind of nuked the area. At least the thing, the whole friggin' thing shook. All right, let's uh, let's try to get the uh, obelisk out here. And real quick, outfits. There's the one I want. Okay, don't freak, don't freak, don't freak. Cool. Control, take. Okay, everything I need. You're good to go. Clear? Clear. Sweet. Okay, there we go. Get the winter closed. Tell me this isn't the perfect. That is that is a hundred percent it right there. All right. We're we are geared for winter. A lot of action here, but uh, I don't think I want to be directly related in whatever is going to happen. Alright, off to, off to strawberry. Let's go. Strawberry. How badass is that? That is totally, that is totally Robert Stockton. Winter, uh, winter gear. <laughs> Robert Stockton Hoth outfit. That stuff, but hey.
Yeah. Yeah, and this is just like a one of the phases of snow in this game. Uh, this is a, a nice kind of a, you know, this is the the uh, Christmas Eve snow, you know, type of thing. And then uh, obviously the uh, the mist and environment, you can just feel it, you know. Um. But uh, yeah, and uh, as it goes along, uh, if we run into a storm, man, the storm is very, very chilling. This is a great ride for uh, snow stuff, so uh, let's make that happen. Once again, thanks everybody for joining me, and I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the uh, uh, the winter, uh, the start of winter here on uh, the PRC server. And uh, like I said, if you uh, you're interested in the uh, uh, the barrel racing that they did earlier, uh, definitely check out the VOD. Uh, there's a really good, uh, really good start and uh, subsequent snowstorm that happens throughout the entire thing, and uh, I have a suspicion that the, that's where we're headed again with this one. Uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna let it kind of ride here. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna get, uh, get around this corner here. And uh, we can find a spot. Bring it up here. That works. And we go over to this side, yeah. Yep. Right about, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Ah, not quite. there's going to be a perfect way to do this, but just a tiny bit over. That's nice. You can use the, uh, the snow prints. Need to be right. The foot needs to be right. There. I think that's it. It better be because I get to go. That's the button I want. Good enough. Awesome. Uh, okay, once again, thanks for joining me, and, uh, tell you what, I'll be back in, uh, a minute. Grab, uh, a little bit more water, and, um, get rid of some of the other water that I've rented. <laughs> Terrible. Uh, dee -dee -dee -dee. I think that was that one. And here we go. Perfect. The White Bone, and their song, Dead Winter. Be right back.
That's fun stuff. Uh, we are headed on back. Uh, it's gonna be. We'll be moving into uh, nighttime. At this point. And, uh. Hopefully, the large contingency of law that went charging on out of town in this direction will, uh. Assure us that uh, there might be somewhat safe passage uh, going this way. But there are no guarantees. And uh, especially when uh, when you're a reporter on the move. Yeah, let's go. moving right along uh thanks again everybody for joining me for uh the uh live stream uh obviously it's probably getting pretty late for quite a few of you and uh it's totally cool i appreciate you guys swinging on by make sure to catch the pod and uh for those of you who may be new to the channel uh don't forget to uh like and subscribe over on uh youtube and uh make sure to uh give me a follow on Twitch if you're hanging out there. I appreciate it. And uh, that way you get notifications when uh, the next uh, dime novel comes around. Um, I, uh, I'm i not sure. I, I think I'm going to be doing another one uh, tomorrow night. Because uh, it, it definitely seems to be popping. And uh, I really want to get to the beginning of the winter. Uh, 
to uh, for everybody to kind of see that. It looks like a lot of things are going on, so that's awesome. And uh, we'll uh, not only do that, but to uh, also uh, follow up on some other stuff that uh, that uh, I was uh, planning on doing, but uh, didn't get to. I mean, uh, tonight was pretty great. We uh, so far we uh, ran all the way out from uh, uh, Saint Denis and uh, went out and caught the races. And, uh, and then after the races, uh, we uh, we were uh, there when the uh, the anarchists blew up the uh, the press office. Those bastards, right? I don't know. I love how uh, immediately there's a you know a story, <laughs> and I threw in the anarchist thing. So we'll see if that takes. But uh, that's definitely the way that I'm going to spin it. And uh, we'll see. Like I said, I, I love throwing lore out there and seeing uh, seeing if it boomerangs its way back. Which, uh, a couple of instances, that's already happened. So, uh, kudos, to, uh, kudos to the community for uh, moving information around. And uh, there was the other thing I noticed tonight. I don't know if you guys caught it. But uh, here in the fourth, uh, the fourth installment, the fourth dime novel, uh, a couple of people have already, have already not only uh, um, recognized me, uh, but also uh, they, uh, somebody that uh, had never met Robert, uh, knew that he was quote unquote the journalist uh, coming out to cover it. I think I, uh, <laughs> I think I. I think I somewhat amused and maybe frustrated a tiny bit the lawmen that were uh, hanging out there because uh, something else big happened tonight on the server. Um, one of uh, the captain, I think, uh, of uh, uh, something. I don't know if it was the Rangers. I hope it wasn't the Rangers. Because good God, I'm in trouble if that's the case. Um, but, uh, you no, know, the, the, uh, the captain of the Rangers, uh, or the captain, I think was what I had referred to him, or somebody had referred to him, uh, was shot and killed tonight. So, uh, whoever that character was, uh, I didn't get a chance to meet him, and, uh, never will again. Uh, that's the, uh, the status of, uh, such things here. When, uh, somebody is permit, they're gone. And, uh... Hence uh, the uh, <laughs> hence hence the the shakedown uh, that I got there, and it didn't help that uh, I was also having audio issues that would not allow me to uh, talk for some ungodly reason. So I had to kind of pantomime what the situation was, and uh, seemed to have it cleared up with them. Now uh, they got my name and basically everything else about me. Which is fine because uh, I, I it was a great the uh, great moment of uh, holding up the press ID, and uh, that's going to be a, a obviously important part. Wow, this looks great. Yeah, and, and there's different layers of the snow too. Like this is obviously the early on snowing, um, but eventually, yeah, this gets. This gets good and solid. I'm surprised this hasn't turned to a storm. This is a great, like, you know, this is a solidly accurate snowstorm. Or at least beginning of a fall. Yeah, boy, the uh, the cart is uh, definitely a, a good mode of transit for Robert until the uh, train system gets in place, and then I, I have a feeling that the uh, train system is going to be another great uh, location to uh, move around from place to place, at least to RP that uh, that whole aspect of uh, being this kind of a journalist. 
Always on the move. I get places to go. I can't sit here and talk. Okay, I'll have another. I'll have another whiskey, but uh, that'll do it. And uh, you say you got moonshine. Hmm. How much of that do you have? All right, here's what we're looking for. This is pretty great. This is uh, the swamp location. So the snow is everywhere. There is no getting away from it. Which is kind of interesting. It definitely puts this uh, this area uh, in a different, a very different look. Job. Good. Yeah. Good haul today. Oh, not enough money. Uh, damn. Oh, well. Get what we can get. How was that? God, swamp noises. Probably just a gator. Mansion. Okay. Perfect. That'll work. Away we go. Yeah, we'll definitely head out in Blackwater uh, and restock because I, I was listening. I don't know if you guys caught it there. I was listening to the uh, the menu of uh, things that uh, that they're planning on selling there. And uh, remember, uh, the stuff is you know you do need food and you do need water um, to uh, keep your person your your player conscious. Uh, let's let's slow down a little bit here in town. It's still going too fast there, horse. And it is. There we go. It is super touchy. This is another great spot. Um, when uh, the the city itself is a lot of fun. Uh, as we get closer and closer to uh, Christmas. Uh, because this, this has such a great look to it. Um... It very much fits the season. They've done a really fine job with it. You can kind of see, I mean, it's getting a little thicker on the ground. It'll uh, pick up as time goes on. And uh, obviously uh, the ferocity of the uh, storm that we're experiencing, which eh, isn't that much right now. But it definitely makes makes for fun, and uh, it'll really be great to, to see how it plays out in the RP as uh, we keep going on in the month. It's a really great community, and uh, man, some super creative people, and really good for the uh, the on the fly stuff, uh, as you uh, as you probably saw there uh, for the. Um, for the races and then all the crazy stuff that went on there uh, at the bar plus the stuff that uh, that we saw earlier at the bar we met uh, Micah He's, he was a very cool dude uh, one of the uh, uh, players kind of uh, playing an older gentleman uh, who uh, was tending bar there I, I got the impression that he, he had another job but uh, he was uh, picking up for uh, for them um, as uh, things are going on. Um, because the crazy thing, the things that were going on was that uh, that uh, uh, the other guy that we had met earlier uh, had been kidnapped. 
and uh, the uh, the cads, the fiends, the ruffians uh, that uh, we know know as the Baller King uh, was uh, responsible, or at least that's what the word on the street was. And you can kind of see how that works. This is such a great, uh, great microcosm for that, because uh, you know sometimes the information is second, third, fourth hand. Uh, are there horses backed up here? There's one. See if we can get it to move. I think it to be fairly close to this. Yeah. All right, We're getting up. Thank you. Nice run. But uh, it's time for you to sleep. Good. Two. And the next thing that we need to do. Get Obi. Get Obi out. Let's do some gear switching. I'd be interested to see what they see when they go through your inventory. I'm sure the, ch the the cops that were looking at it got a chuckle out of it. And uh, the guy that searched uh, might have been a bit shaken by what he saw in the inventory. The live worms. <laughs> the live crickets. The weird assortment of stuff. Perfect. <laughs> Okay, I think everything else is good. Uh, we got the water that we need. I think I got one more orange on me. Right? Double check our inventory, make sure. Uh, get the gun, get the ammo for the gun. Uh, whiskey for just the hell of it. Oh, that corn. Gotta go. Let's try it out. Trying a little experiment with the uh, corn when I was fishing earlier. Oh, come on, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. Jeez. Corn bait. Get rid of that. Ah, oh, what the hell? We'll just put that whiskey on there. Really need it. Good, good. Uh, we should probably grab two more ammo. There we go. be good not just just to be paranoid since we got a second here and there isn't a lot of people hanging out here where the hell did they go there they are two more oranges that way if for whatever reason we can't get back to the horse we're good we good And we'll put it away. Goodbye. God, like I said, how perfect is this? This is totally... This is what I would expect Robert to be wearing. Going way over the top and getting a crazy amount of gear. And if you think that's not enough, check this out. This was the other nice touch. He's wearing a big old fluffy-ass sweater. He is. He is. He is not joking around. I love it. It's such a great coat, too. I've been uh, looking forward to getting that out. And uh, it does well with the uh, the other... Um, his uh, shoulder pack. Because the shoulder pack is always colliding with, like, there is nothing. 
that uh, I could find that doesn't do this weird kind of thing. But this is one of the better ones. A lot of the time you have to uh, basically pick, you know, a brown coat or uh, change the, uh, the gear in order to make it uh, not so noticeable. But uh, in this case, it works good. And uh, the belts and everything don't uh, collide. So I was really happy with how this turned out. And I just had to, I had to find something for the hat because the hat is so, so hunter. At least he is to me. This totally seems like something he would get. And uh, we do have, uh, we do have uh, instances where um, you get hail. So you definitely want to have like a, a good hard hat like this one. Because it just looks great. They did such a nice job on the detail, like having the strap across the front. Very nice. Morning. It is. It is definitely morning. But uh, yeah, basically my plan was uh, I'm headed over to uh, the saloon where uh, Robert's staying and uh, we'll see if there's anybody there. If not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it a night. This is uh, six hours, six hours and five minutes at this point. And uh, we have uh, seen quite a few things, met quite a few people. And uh, once again, we got the name out there and uh, we actually, we're actually, we actually did the function that we said we were going to do, or at least what we've been telling everybody we do. Uh, sort of. Now, you gotta remember that the other part of, uh, Robert's personality is, uh, turning that in. Hmm. Maybe not as much. But we'll see. You people need to get, uh, some winter clothes. Be serious about this. Freeze it to death like that. That guy gets it. Look at, he's got a good coat. Same with the other guy. Well, he's also a little sauce, so. You two figure out what you're gonna do. Come by. Look out. But, uh, yeah, like I said, I mean, the city looks great. And, uh, the normally kind of weird Christmas lighting. Uh, you can kind of see it up there on the post. Actually fit. Finally. At least for this time of year. I've just been sleeping and trying to take care of things. Came in and dealt with the lawyer and... <laughs> coffee or just bulk coffee ah shit that's right I don't have any money can I get one I can't even get that <laughs> excuse me sir I wanted to see what I had in here. Mm -mm. Ache. Oh, okay, that's right. I knew there was something else. There was one other thing that was actually a useful thing aside from the water. Okay, good. Um, oh. this kind of a good place to uh end it the fact that he died it just oh no it hit me harder than i thought it would hmm. yeah there's gonna be backlash from uh the uh the perma I'll 
great is this? I love this spot up here. <clears throat> and weirdly, there's a there's a whole lot of memories of uh, things that I never did up here. But uh, yeah, this was. There was once a last stand here. Okay. Well, uh, like I said, uh, that uh, that pretty much concludes tonight's harmless content dime novel. Uh, like I said, once again, thanks everybody for joining me, and uh, those of you uh, uh, who showed up for the live stream, I uh, greatly appreciate it. And uh, thanks for all your input. Uh, thanks for helping out. Dull surprise, as always, uh, greatly appreciated. Uh, and uh, uh, thanks for covering that. Also, uh, obviously, GG Hick uh, showing on up here at the very beginning. Uh, and uh, a couple of new folks that uh, jumped in. Island 64. Uh, once again, thanks for uh, joining me. And uh, yeah, it was very cool uh, having you jump in and uh, uh, recognize recognize the voice. Um, and uh, yeah, like I said, good luck. And uh, hopefully we'll see you around uh, on PRC. Uh, but uh, if not, uh, good luck wherever you go. And uh, have great streams. Um, and uh, yeah, everybody else that uh, that was lurking and uh, swinging on by. Uh, who else was there? There was uh, Abe Barrios. Uh, greatly appreciated. And uh, thanks for uh, jumping on in. Good heart. And uh, of course, Coley. I'm glad you can make it, man. And uh, I'm glad you had fun watching it. It's uh, it's really fun to do it, and uh, it's always great to uh, to know that uh, people are appreciating it. Um, let me. Uh, I, there's not a bunch of us here, but uh, what the hell? Why not? Let's uh, let's see if we can find somebody to uh, raid, and at least uh, jump on over to uh, somebody else's stream. So I need to remember to do this more. Okay, let's see, I do that. Okay, there's the dashboard. Uh, yeah, let's close it up here with uh, back to square one. Once again, the white bones. Thanks for joining me, everybody. Have a great night, and uh, like I said, stick around. We're going to uh, raid somebody. Shoot. I should probably check that out first before I hit the button. Um, anybody, doll? Jump on over there. Bartender. Go hang out with him. Sounds like a good idea. Thanks again, everybody, for watching. Uh, greatly appreciate it. Have a great day, and uh, we'll see you the next time. Thanks for joining me for uh, another uh, Armless Content Time novel. Take care.